Okay, it is technically live. We can work through audio and whatever. Okay. First bit here should be okay. I hope I had some weird audio stuff going on a minute ago, so I hope that it's not uh, having too much trouble. Hello! Are you there, Inkblot? Mr. Steve, hello. How are we doing? Oh, what? That's weird. Okay, you sound like really like chipmunky. Let me. I think that might be on my end because Badgers was doing that too. Hold on, I'm gonna hop out and then hop back in. Okay. Uh, if you could speak. Yeah, that's weird. Okay, for some reason it's all like super high pitched. Um, that is really bizarre. Okay. Uh, shoot. I don't know what kind of a problem that would even be. Let me see if I can switch around my outputs, and that might help. Uh, if you could speak again. Um. What is going on with that? Okay, weird. Huh. Uh. I hear everyone's fine, and they have to go back to stuff as normal. Yeah. I don't know why it's doing that. It's a, it. Hold on, hold on. I'm gonna, I'm gonna start a new uh, voice channel so everybody just drop out, and I'll see if that fixes it. Okay, hopefully this will fix it. All right, let's see if that fixed it. Hello? Hello? It's still doing that. Why, why would it do that? Why is that even an option? So today's game is kind of and chipmunks? <laughs> yeah, yeah, it just sa it sounds full on like Alvin the Chipmunks for all of you. I don't know why it's doing that. That's so bizarre. Huh. Let me... Let me try one more thing to see if I can fix that. In the meantime, feel free to join the actual game on Tabletop Simulator. Uh, yes, yellow is the citizen. And we're going to be playing with the Oath Keeper of Protection. That's so weird. Why does it why is it doing that? Hold on, hold on a sec. Huh? So, you, you, sound, you sound fine to me, do I sound fine to you? Yeah, as yeah, soon you as sound I fine. go okay. out of the multi output device I was using, you guys sound normal, but then as soon as I go into it, let me check one more time here. Let me try one more time. Uh, oh, you know what?
to my mic now. Okay, so that finally came back in. So, yeah, I don't know what's going on with the audio here. Let me see if I can get it going. Come on, check, 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 check. Come on, anything, anything. Why is it not connecting? Will that change anything? No. So, okay. I'm trying to fix this on the fly, but this is this is very aggravating. Come on now, come on now. I need this mic to work so that they can hear me. If I can't get that one to work, then they won't be able to hear me at all. Come on, come on. Oh boy, push to talk, will that make it work? Check, 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 check. Yep, yep. It randomly, randomly decided to uh, mute me there. I don't think, or no, that was that was one of my shortcuts. Okay. Come on. Voice activity. Can I get it? No. Maybe if I just do the built-in. No. It refuses. It refuses to do it. Oh, come on. Discord. Stop. Ah. It refuses to accept any of my inputs. I don't know what is going on, but it just won't accept anything. Okay. Oh, wait. There we go. There we go. Okay. And then let me see. Can I switch it to the multi-output? Yes. Okay. Now let's switch back to the voice call. Let me see if I can get this going. Oh, please tell me this is working. Yeah. Ah, no, chipmunk. Ah. It's, the thing is, if it was just chipmunk, that wouldn't be a problem, but it's also, like, it's also, like, really garbled, so it's very difficult to understand even outside of that. Oh, boy. So my options are either... I shut it off so they won't... The stream won't be able to hear you guys... Or, or I, uh, or I just, I, I think I'm going to have to do that. So, yep, that sucks, but, yep, sorry, sorry, anybody watching. We're going to have to, we're going to have to go with me being able to actually hear the people I'm playing with. All right, if one of you could speak, please. Yeah, see, there we go. So yeah, it's just whatever I try and do to send your guys' audio to the stream and be able to hear it myself, uh, it turns y'all into a bunch of chipmunks, so I don't know. I don't know what I'm going to do about that. Regardless, uh, for now, I think... 
God, I, uh, I, I think we'll go without. Hmm. I or maybe ah. Uh, uh. Well, Badger wants white. There you go. I can just yeah. I I yeah. I think it was just because I'm first up in that. Um, okay. <sighs> Trying to think if there's any way I can make this work. Hmm. I don't know. Let me see if I can set it one more time, see if that'll fix it. No, no, that's not going to work. Hmm. Okay, okay. I have no idea why I would even do that. That's so bizarre. Um, okay, let's see. This, that, or wait, is it because of that? Maybe? Uh, I suppose I could try one more time to make this. Let me, let me give this one more shot. If I hopefully can figure out how to do this correctly. It should go to both of those. And then I will do that manually. This is my last shot. If it doesn't work, I'm just going to have to have everybody think I'm a lunatic talking to nobody. Ah, oh, boy, that already doesn't sound promising. Could one of you speak, please? Ah, nope, nope. Okay, yeah, I'm just going to have to... They're, they're only going to hear me talking, so that'll be interesting, but oh well. Ah, oh, boy. Okay, so in the meantime, let me... Hold on, grab my phone. I'll be right back. Okay, so, yeah, apologies to the three people watching. Um, I The audio is weird, and I'm not able to capture everybody else's audio without them uh, getting really high-pitched for some reason. So, st you're just going to be hearing me on the actual stream. Um, it, well, no, I'm using uh, I Show You audio capture stolen vex uh i guess that could be the problem hold on let me see if i can find the settings for that where is it specifically at hmm I suppose I could uninstall it and reinstall it. Let me see if there's a way to capture desktop audio just in OBS um, natively. Hmm. No. Mm, what about there? Video capture device. I source audio output capture. Maybe that'll do it. Let's see if that'll work. Nope. Nope. It's I show you still, so. Well, maybe default. Let's see. Let's see if that'll work. If one of you could speak. Oh, can you not hear me in the call now? Or is that getting all messed up oh uh, no no still there hmm uh crap i don't have any like test audio i could use <sighs> oh 
Okay. Hmm. Huh. This has never happened. I've uh, captured specifically Discord audio. Did they change something in the last... In the last... Update? Something? I don't know. I don't know why, why it'd be like this. Hmm. Well, you know what? I think I'm gonna do... <laughs> I wouldn't normally recommend this, but uh, I'm gonna do something really quick. I'll be right back. This is gonna be a little um, odd. As far as all of that goes, then, uh, all right. Ah, so yeah, this is a, a kind of a silly setup, but it will work. So yeah, have Discord on my phone, phone's pointed at the mic, so you guys can, on the stream can hear me and you can hear everybody in the Discord call. Not ideal, but it works, technically. Hmm. Oh, shoot, my camera's getting all blown out because my window's open. One sec. Ah, there we go. 
And with that, it's nighttime. Okay, okay, so is everybody in now? Yeah, I believe so. Awesome. Okay, I'm actually going to raise uh, my audio on the stream. So, anybody who's watching on the stream who is not familiar, this is a game by Leader Games. It was designed by Cool Whirly. Is it Whirl or Whirly? I've never gotten that straight. Whirly. Whirly, okay. And uh, art is by Kyle Farron. They worked previously on Root Together, which is like the smash hit of 2018. Definitely go check it out. I believe they're doing a new expansion kickstarter sometime in the summer ish they're talking about it on their twitch and stuff but we're going to be playing a six player game which is the max you can have and it's a uh, yeah it's going to be a little crowded on this board but it should be fun um all right so with all of that said let's see everybody's got a color uh oop, i gotta set the turns uh, options, turns, custom, uh, purple is first, for sure, uh, oop, and let's do, I imported the chronicle, yes, setup, all right, yep, everybody's gonna be in, confirm, protection, correct, and there we go, okay, uh, now, if we want, we could uh, randomize your guys' uh, turn order. Chancellor always goes first, but you guys could be randomized if you'd like. No, it's fine. Yep. Okay. I'm fine with it. <laughs> okay, so we're just going to go clockwise then, so let me just uh, move things around real quick. So I'm going to go red, red, brown, blue, yellow, white. Correct. All right. So with all of that done, everybody pick a starting site for your pawn. And grab your three war bands, your one favor, and your one secret. As the chancellor, I get two favor. All right. And then I start as the Oath Keeper. It, ooh, come on, over the name. There we go. And the Oath Keeper of Protection. So this one is whoever holds the most relics and banners. I start out holding the Grand Scepter, which is the only relic that we start with. So I am Oath Keeper. And Citizen, you get to win if you hold the People's Favor if I win. So if... if, if yeah. Yeah. Just like yesterday, right? <laughs> yeah. I I've played one game where I was Chancellor and someone was Citizen, and they were they were very aggressive. So I'm keeping an eye on you. Oh, and select uh one of the advisors you've been dealt to be your one of your starting advisors. Can somebody drop a favor over here. Must be, uh... Must have accidentally dropped from somebody. That's alright. Everybody has one, so we'll just drop that back in the supply. Uh, ooh, which of these do I want to keep? Oh, that's a good one. Uh, hmm. I think, uh, I'm gonna keep... This one. I got a really good starting hand here. Kind of sucks I got to discard two of them. Yep. Oh, and... Uh, I hope nobody saw that. Um. Uh. Oh, yeah, and be sure before you discard to pick where your pawn is at so you know which one you're discarding to. <laughs> starting with two... One, one, and one. Let's see, what do we have out? Memory of home. Okay. Long bows, sprawling rampart. There we go. Okay. Um, oh, and the salt flats starts with 
two favor and a secret. So if anybody wants those, they can start there. Ooh. Pretty low frame rate, but that's that's just gonna be par for the course in a setup like this. <laughs> Oh, and I should check what's in the Imperial Reliquary. Okay. Yeah, my ping is so high as well. Mm, yeah. I mean, for this, it's not like real time for the most part, so... Hmm. Some enemies are gonna get discarded here. Yeah. That one's pretty good. Okay, and what is all of these again? Alright, go ahead. Alright. So, uh, I'm going to start... Let's see, I want to hang on to the relic. So, obviously, first thing I'm going to do is run over to the Hinterlands. Oops, wait. Is everybody oh. up yet? Or... Oh, yeah, yep. wait, wait, wait. Yeah, everybody, everybody get your pawn out and your uh, choose your advisor. Apologies. Was jumping the gun on that. And then what was this again? Okay. Um, hold on. I should lift this a little higher. I'm gonna be straining my neck otherwise. There we go. Okay. Hmm. What is my plan? Uh, Rennie, are, did you get yours out then, or? Uh, did what? Did you place your pawn? Yeah, yeah. It's in okay. the... Okay, I was... Okay. All right, the planes, the planes. All right, next, everybody's next place... The, uh, <laughs> I did that, too. It's, it's a little easy to forget with this, because the discard piles, for anybody who hasn't played Oath, these here are all face down, and you're not actually supposed to reveal what you're discarding. It's a little weird, but you get used to it. All right. So, if everyone is ready, I will take my turn, which is going to start. Yep, yeah, ready. I, I'm going to start by trading with longbows for an order favor. Then I'm going to spend one, two, three, four favor to zip over to the tribunal. I'm going to drop one of my warbands there. And I'm going to spend another to recover with these three favor into the order bank. That relic. Whatever it may be, it is. That that one. What's that? Dragonskin drum. I gain one warband after traveling. Ah, I wish I'd had that before I moved. That's fine. That's fine. All right, I'll put it over by the Grand Scepter. And, hmm, don't really have any more supplies, so I'm just going to rest there. 16 plus 1. So that is the end of my turn. Okay. Uh, let's see. And now search is 2, so I'm going to go ahead and do that from the world deck. A vision! A vision! Okay. That was your third. That's lucky. Yeah, I got, I got lucky. Alright, so... I'm gonna play this.
Need that money. Mm -hmm. All right, and that is the merchant. Ooh, okay. Yeah, that looks pretty tasty. All right, and you did get your favor? Oh, I did not. Thank you. Yeah, don't forget. Or, well, that comes from the Beast Bank, actually. Correct. Can play a Beast card? I'm actually going to just draw again. Yeah. Three, three more. At this point, it's pretty cheap, so it's a good time for it. Two. So then I think I'm going to muster. Okay. And then that'll cost me one, and then that's actually going to be my turn. So I have nine more bands plus one because I didn't use it, so that goes there. All right. This is going to go to the animals. How do I pass the turn? Oh, uh, it should be on the top of your screen. It'll say end turn. Perfect. Thank you. There you go. And then our black player does not have a mic, so I believe he is listening, but he's not able to say anything. So be sure to check uh, the chat in the bottom left to see any messages. Who is he in uh, Discord? Is that P.E. Badger? Uh, no, Badger is uh, Captain Badger. It's Hollow Knight. Yep. No, Hollow Knight is the one I with no speak. mic. Oh, uh, yeah. I think Flying Elmo as well, looks like. Uh, Flying Elmo is uh, my significant daughter that's just listening in. <laughs> oh, okay, yeah, that's no no worries. We're just looking both at screen, and we don't have uh, a double headset. Yeah. yeah, we have, but on two different stations. Okay, yeah, I'm just trying to keep track of everything, so no worries. Yeah, she she's learning, so that's fine. All right, so what is Black doing? Black doing? Let's see, spent three supply. Okay, they searched. Got it. Hmm. So the way Fey Merchant reads to me is if you only have the one relic you just drew, you end up putting that back on the bottom. Uh... I I've heard that too, but since it doesn't put say Hmm. I know it doesn't say then, so presumably There might be an FAQ on that at the leader site in the there's a card database there. Yeah. If you hover over some cards it will show the FAQ after a moment, but that one says no FAQ, so I'm not sure. Ooh, the hidden place. Which all 
Right, and then, uh, Black, you'll need to flip your secret face down since you went to the hidden place. Burn a secret to get that relic. At this point in the game, that's going to be a little tricky. Last one. Wow. What's your plan? Oh, campaigning against the bandits? All right. Are you just going after the hidden place? Because the thing is, though, if you want to campaign at the hidden place, you have to flip a secret it's again. Secret, yeah. yeah. So unfortunately, like you won't be able to do it this turn. I know, last game we had that as well in the Hinterlands, and uh, we kept forgetting that it's really a bottleneck some might say hidden even ah that, that tracks White's gonna get that secret on the salt flats. That's pretty sweet. Yep. Yeah. Seemed like a good idea. Yeah, I wanted the relic, but somebody decided to uh, take it first. <laughs> well, at the there's no relic at the salt flats. Oh no! I mean, I started where I started because I'm the fox. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> Sorry. For some reason, I thought I thought you were white because you. Oh, we're talking about the salt flats. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the, that was my choice. I was looking at those two sides to start. Okay. Mr. Steve. Alrighty. I'm going to spend three, uh, three supply and go into the world deck. All right. Oh, well, vision. Pump that up to two. Okay. Set that one right there. We must set that right there. And then I'm going to spend three to move. Okay. I'm going to come down to the middle of the hinterlands. And it's the Fertile Valley. Mr. Chancellor. Question. Yes. I get your warbands on my board, right? Not my own. Yes. Basically, yeah. any warbands you have will be replaced. Oh, yeah. So... As far as yours, yes. So let me so, get those over to you. Uh, and you didn't refresh today. Right. Um, well, that wouldn't change because I'm still at 12 and I had one saved. Oh, okay. So I, I still in the same place. But yes, you are correct. Any, any that you use will be that and you will refresh back to wherever mine is when your wake phase start or when your rest phase happens. Yeah. I never played a citizen, so I was still getting it. I've played it. Uh, no, I haven't played it. Every time I play yellow at the end, I always get turned into a citizen by the, by the uh, chronicle. But I never actually end up playing it. Ooh, spirit snare, nice. All right, and you can still use that since it doesn't take up any supply to use the action. Where do I want to take it from? That's a good question. It's how everybody's keeping their hands 
face down, so it's hard to tell what is going to be one. the most wanted. Take one from order. Okay. And I have one left. So, I think I'm going to, you know, no, I'm not going to do any more. I will rest. That takes me to nine plus one. Mm -hmm. I will pull that back. And. Ready. Yeah. Um. Um, just to be sure, the welcome in party says if you play a denizen card that was not a face down advisor gain from the bank. Um, but if I play it to my advisors, does that count? Uh, no. So it's basically if it's played to your advisors, it is an advisor. If it's played to the board, it's a denizen. Yeah. So basically, if you do a search and then decide to play it to the board, um, then you and also get one favor from the hearth bank. As long uh, as you uh, your pawn is there or you rule there. I'm gonna you do, put uh, a favor Empire. on the people's favor and a secret on the banner of the dark secret. Because okay. that was forgotten. Oh, yeah. Thank you. I'm doing that oh. as part of setup. Yeah, we always forget to do that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I was looking at it and I was like, oh, there it is. <laughs> Let's drop the purple die over here. Okay, I'm gonna um I'm gonna trade. Mm-hmm. Bring one from the order. Then I'm gonna get the banner of the people's favor. Alright. Which, yes, that is how you win here. Unless I exile you, which is an yeah. option to me. Yeah, maybe you will. Maybe. I'd need at least five favor for it, so it depends on if it's worth it. That was my two supply. So then I will search the deck. All Coming right. Cost me. Ooh, another vision. A seen a vision. All right. And the next one is right on top. Lovely. Oh boy. Quick question. If I um, destroy the longbows with my uh, people's favor, sure. uh, do I get the secret? Yeah, you, you still get your secret yeah. back. Okay. Yeah, you only get to do it if you're playing to the site, but that opens up yeah, a lot course, of room of for course. you. Uh, yeah, Stolen Vex in the chat asked, how can you tell if they're visions? If you look here, uh, that is the normal card back, and then this is the vision card back. There are five of them in the deck. So the, the big eye is what differentiates them. Yeah, I'm going to play this. I'm getting my secret back then. This gets discarded. Okay. Uh, playing this to the site. Okay, and that's... Ooh. Ooh, that's pretty... That's pretty expensive, but also it's it'll be very good for at least one campaign. Yep. That's why. Um, but I played the welcome... I, I can also use the welcome party because of this. So I'm getting one half favor. Because the welcome uh, yeah. party... If I play a denizen card. 
Yeah, so you get uh, one from get one, one from, Discord. from Discord. Yeah, yeah. one from Discord Cross and one from cards. Welcoming Party. Yeah, true. Um, yeah, I think I'm gonna search the Cradle Discord. Okay. This turn. I played a vision to my advisors and gonna discard this to the provinces. That was my two last two supply. So the supply goes back to the one that was for you. Yep. Um it goes to the left almost leftmost space because you're there, right? If yes. you save it, I get to save it too, right? Or something. Uh yeah. basically yeah. At wherever mine is at I'm you, just copying it. You refresh and then it to there. Saving my own. Yes, anything you save yeah. you will get to do past that. Yeah, okay, thank you. That was my turn then, ending turn. Okay, um... I get to claim this secret in the wake phase. I could have taken a favor, but it seems like the secret's a little better. So. I agree. Uh, for now, what do I want to do? All those... Um, just a quick question. If hmm. I get exiled, every, every warband on the board is yours, right? Yes. Only the one on my uh, player board uh, are converted to mine. I right. believe right. so, yes. Yeah, yes. okay, thanks. Let me, let me see here. All right, I'm going to spend... I, I should grab my rule book. Two supply and move to... Out to the provinces. Here, and then this is locked, correct? Mm -hmm. Unlock it and then flip it. Ooh, the mine. Three I have to load that around. up with three and a relic. Yep. Or, well, actually, only one card can be played there. <clears throat> oh, yeah. Was it three over there? Uh, three over there. Three. Yep. You can see there's in the... No more in the... There's no more in the bucket. Okay, uh, we can clone one of those then. Let me oh, just... Yeah. Uh, clone. Mm, there. All right. Okay, so that's two. Uh, I will peek at the relic. Cost three, favor. Um, I will spend... I'm going to search that this card. You want to get the relic, right? Get that face down. And discard these two. Uh, and to clarify, Renny, uh, you were correct that you'll get to keep the warbands on your board, just switching them out for your color. 
The other thing to yeah. keep in mind is because you hold the people's favor, I gotta pay you one extra favor, but because I hold the if Oathkeeper, you want to one armory, less. Right? What's that? If you want to exile me, if I want yes. to exile myself... Uh, to um... exile yourself, you have to get the Grand Scepter away from me, but that is a possibility. Mm, is it? Oh, yeah, I, oh yeah, true. I'm gonna send another two to... Search this no, I can I can give it to you, yeah. and then I can exile myself. Yep. Okay. Giving favor equal to the secrets on your board and on Dedison relics and edifice cards, not the darkest secrets, plus the number of warbands on your board. So actually, all the darkest secrets that all, all the secrets that are in my possession, and the warbands on my board. So it costs me four favor now. Hmm. Okay. If I want to exile myself. Sure. If you want to. It's a lot easier for you, because all you gotta if, do is hang on if, to the people's if. favor. Yeah, that's true. It actually says you can't uh, exile yourself if you have the Grand Scepter. True. Oh, okay, I got that you backwards. Yes. I haven't actually run into that situation yet, because oh, any the... games I've played with citizens, they've started as citizens, so... Yeah, and the uh, one who has the Grand Scepter can uh, exile someone. So if the Grand Scepter goes to an exile, he can exile me. Okay. All right, so I'll play that to the site. Okay. Uh, and then I, I gain one for playing it, and then I, I don't gain one, though, for a welcoming party, because I don't own that, correct? Yeah, you I don't, don't rule that, there, right? you just, but you do so get I one from Hearth. From Hearth. And then... more if I want to. Remember, you can still, you can do Wayside Inn's action uh, for just the one favor. It won't cost you any supply. That's uh, true, yeah. I want to go, I don't want to go anywhere. I'm going to... I'm going to muster there. Mm. So that's one supply for four bands. I think that's it. So I'm at nine. So I go there and then I have one left. So I'm at the top. Throw that in the earth bank. And I think I'm done. Okay. Great. So now we're into round two. How long did that take? Not too long. Okay. This might not drag on too long, depending on how many rounds we end up doing. So my first action is going to be spending three supply to move down to Fertile Valley, um, which I get a war band because I have Dragon Skin Drum. And then... Oh, actually... You know what, I'm going to take that back real quick, because before I head down there, I want to uh, use Fey Merchant. Let's see. That is... Uh, Cup of Plenty. Alright, and I have to get rid of Dragon Skin Drum. Uh, oh shoot, uh, let me see if I remember how to do this, you, yeah, it, whoop, no, hold on, I got, yeah, uh, how is it that you put it to the bottom of a deck? To sort of slide it in with both buttons somehow, but I don't, I Here, yeah, I'll just drop it there, just drop the rest of the deck on top, ah, mission drawn marker, no, everything's gone wild, okay, okay, we got it, <laughs> all right, all right, um, so shoot, that was actually a pretty bad move on my part since I kind of just ended up with the same amount. That's fine. I'm just gonna, I'm still gonna scoot. No, I'm only gonna move two so that I can get over here. I'm going to, uh, can't muster. 
because I used the secret. Shoot. Hmm. I might have done this in incorrectly. I, I well. messed that up. I should only be on nine. I used my last one to muster. So. Hmm. Okay. But, yeah. Uh, and then I need. Just in case anybody was. Ah, oh, shoot. So we're, not, so we're not getting mad at you <laughs> for cheating. <Yeah>. Uh... <laughs> it's okay. Mistakes are made. So yeah. everyone oh, knows. I was just re replaying it in my head. And I was like, oh. That doesn't add up. Boy, I really... Stealth Keeper of Protection, right? Let's, let's... Yeah. Oh, that's a good spot for you, yeah. Shoot, I really messed this turn up. Okay, I'll, um... I'm gonna spend another two... Move up to, uh, move down here. Um, what is this? Ah. You need a secret. Uh. Do you need a secret to go there? I do. You're right. Ah, shoot. Okay, I'll go up to the Lush Coast instead. And then I'm going to draw from this discard with search. Oh boy. Yeah, I, I really messed that turn up. Hmm. Ooh. That's a pretty good one. Uh. Well. Yeah, I'm gonna take this and put it face down. And that will be my turn. So I got 13, I don't go back up to anything, and I'm going to end my turn. There we go. Wow, yeah, I really messed that up. I should have should have hung on to the dragon skin drum, actually. Oh, and yeah, I get my secret back. Whoop. All right, so I think first thing I'm going to do is draw from... Hinterlands. It's actually pretty good. Oh, man. Mountain Giant. Hmm. Okay, and you do get a favor, but to be clear, that's my battle plan since I rule there. Yep. I have, I have other... For now. Hmm. That sprawling rampart makes things... Yeah, makes well... Nice, huh? yeah. Sprawling I mean, rampart's only, yeah. only sites, though, and since we're playing protection... It's more my relics yeah. and banners I gotta protect. I was just thinking along the lines of if he wanted to go after this to oh, yeah. move that giant. I'm gonna trade, so I'm gonna gain one. And then this isn't optimal, but I'm gonna play my faithful friend to gain okay. four supply. Okay. Um, and then I will take two... F I will... Trade again for one. And then I will gain a secret. Yes. All right. Um, I think then I'm going to spend four to move. Oh, big to move. Mind. We're going to the city. Oh, Pale King, it wasn't um that he was traded he was trading both of the favor for the secret, so that one was open. Yeah, you are correct, it's just um in this circumstance it was correct. Uh spend let's see, spend my other secret. I'm going to spend that actually going to reveal my other advisor. What do you got? So I'm going to spend that to get two more. Okay. Nice one. 
uh, that would cost me a supply, and then my last supply, I will... But, muster. um, wait. Go ahead. It, it, that's not true, right? Any exile isn't the Oathkeeper or the Usurper. Oh, it's not in rest. Oh, sorry. It's not a one yeah. place. I mean, I don't have any my favor bad. either, so it doesn't matter. It's not triggering. Yeah. No, it's not triggering. Sorry. I thought it was. Yeah, no, it's not triggering. You, you were just using it for your for the match, trade. Match, exactly, yeah. to get that extra money. So then I'm going to spend my last supply to muster. I need you to muster on something. Uh, doesn't really matter. One, two, and that is my turn. So I'll go ahead and turn and just kind of clean up. Okay. So Pale King's turn. And this one goes to the order. Yep. And there we go. Oh, okay, and then I have seven. So if I'm grokking this correctly, the Chancellor is winning because they have two relics? Uh, currently, yes. I am the Oath Keeper, but I can't win as the Oath Keeper until the end of round five at the earliest. Yeah, you roll the dice. And then right behind you is your citizen with the banner. Yes, so technically if I win... Technically he would they win. win. Yeah. Technically I would win. Because what is the successor? The I'm people's successor. Oh, you're yeah. the people's favorite. And you are. Yep. Oh, whoops, I forgot to discard these cards after I searched on my turn. Sorry. And those would have gone to the hinterland. I should have discarded to the cradle. I think I discarded to the hinterlands, actually. Oh, okay. Uh, so let's just pop those two off. And then just be two. take those two to the... Whoa, whoa, whoa. There, and there. All right. Oh, looks like it's campaign against the bandits at the Fertile Valley. They don't have any battle plans, so let's see how this Only rolls the out. the Fertile Valley? Not another one? And that's oh, three that's versus one, one, so you win. And then once you have a warband on a site, you can use a minor action to place more. Yep. Yeah, you can place as many as you'd like from your board there right now. Yep. Oh, you're revealed and playing Wizard School. On this card. Wow. Huh. I mean, as long as you do that at the end of your act phase, it's really good. Yeah, it's pretty powerful. Yep. Oh, and it actually costs two favor to trade for a secret. And in fact, no, it doesn't. It doesn't because oh, of the wizard. Right. Yep. Sorry, I just read that. Ugh. <laughs> My bad. You're right. You're right. All right. <laughs> I'm playing advisor to mine. Oh, the elders. 
Oh, okay. Got that Nomad Love coming out. I'm going to spend two to go into the Hinterlands deck. Okay. I'll just guard down here to the cradle. Yep. I am going to put two favor on the elders. All right, and grab your secret. All righty. And then I'm going to spend two to move. Okay. And now I'm going to come down here to the hidden place. All right. And be sure to flip one of those secrets. I'm going to flip a secret. And then I'm going to spend one. Burn one, I should say. And spend one supply. To recover that relic. Okay. I don't even know where it is, but I want it. Are you able to burn the flipped one? I'm going to guess no, because it's... No, spent. yeah, you can't do anything else with it no. on the same turn. Got it. And we have... Oh, that's... The dowsing sticks. Yeah, so that's a guaranteed relic, which in this game can be pretty strong. It, it's kind of costly, but... Not too bad. Seems good for this one condition. Yep. All right, and then I'm gonna. I think I am going to play a card to a site. Ooh, old oak. And then I am going to muster on that card. Okay. And that will leave me with nine more bands in the bag, one supply saved, so that takes me back up to full. And then these two go on Nomad. This one goes on Beast. Yep. And that ends my turn. Yep. Oh, and flip your secret back over. Thank you. Okay. I will put a uh, favor on the people's favor. Then I'm gonna search my deck, uh, my discard. Appreciate that. Could really use some in the discard pile over here in the provinces. He's just gonna exile you at the at the last turn. Yeah, probably. <laughs> well, I'll burn everything down. <laughs> he yeah. might have the he might have the uh, vision. Last mm -hmm. turn, it doesn't. Oh. Well, yeah. Timing on that. Yeah. Well, the thing is, you can't do visions as citizens, so you'd have to get exiled first right. to use yeah. it. Yeah, you have to be exiled first. Well, you can you can self exile, right? It's just it's pretty costly. Mm-hmm. 
So since the you're saying since the empire wins and he has the people's favor, he technically wins even though he doesn't have more relics than you. Yeah, how it works Correct. is um whoever fulfills the oath is the oath keeper, and any citizen that fulfills the successor underneath, regardless of what the oath is, will win instead. If I'm the oath keeper, and the game ends. can basically think of it as the empire wins and yep. then between which of them yeah the citizen takes over basically i'm uh, gonna play the storm color to my advisors okay mm. and discard the other one other one wait how many did you draw oh. no yeah yeah you, you should draw three with that Mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> if you want you can take the storm color back we'll just know that it's in the discard mm -hmm. yeah. which I already did because I had it in uh, my last search yeah I'm gonna do that sorry yeah no no problem it happens I'm gonna play this one Ah, you got long bows. Dang it. It's not it's yeah, not especially powerful, but it's often just helpful enough. Yeah, because I'm gonna uh, uh, trade now. I'm gonna trade with the sprawling rampart. Mm, yeah. So it gives me two from the order bank, because I have a matching one. Um, where's your pawn? Your pawn is over there. Okay. Um, Mr. Wow. Supreme uh, uh, Oath Keeper Chancellor. <laughs> yes. <laughs> am, am I, hello. Yeah, am I allowed to there. muster? <laughs> uh, what was that? Am I allowed to muster? Uh, let's see. How many are left in the bag right now? 13. You may. You may do so once. Okay. I will muster then. I want to. I want to keep at least eleven for right now. Okay, good to know. And that gives me one, and then I ref uh, end my turn and I refresh to the leftmost space. Uh, yes. All right, Captain Badger. Okay, I start in the mine, so I'll grab a favor. Mm-hmm. Oh boy. I will. Hmm. Oh, yep. Don't forget to uh, take your secret back and everything. Whoop. Whoop. Then two to travel down to the hidden place, which means I have to flip a secret. Yep. Then I will reveal. So the way I'm reading sprawling rampart is just plus one defense, or is it more? It's uh one more dice per site targeted. Okay. So now I will trade with the old oak. Mm. And. Oh. I get. Two secrets. Yep. Boy, yeah, I really ran my economy into the ground early. Oh boy. So that costs one to trade. Then I will go ahead and spend one to recover the darkest secret. Yep. Uh, 
And you get to keep the one that's on it. Yep. But, uh... I'll put three on there. Yeah. And reclaim the one that's there. Are you allowed to put more than it says? Let me see that. I guess it just says more, not one more. Yeah, you can yeah, pack them all in there. Yeah. You can spend as many as you want. Hmm. And... I don't think anybody's taking that. <laughs> I will spend... Spend my last two to... Uh, I can search, the, now that I have the Darkest Secret, I can search the world deck. Yeah, you only get the one you vision, unfortunately. I but... would only get the one vision, right? But yeah. I'll go with the three in the provinces instead, but there's only two cards in the provinces. I know, so is I it worth it? No, one vision, or... Uh, I will search the provinces and get rid of what's there. Ah, okay. So I'm going to keep this one, I'll put him face down, and I'll flip that one, and send him back. I got it. Oh, thank you. It was off the edge of my screen and I was sort of guessing. Yeah. Okay, so uh, that's it for me. So I go up to nine, and we put two with the beasts. And my secret back. And I think that's it. Okay. Gosh, what okay. am I actually even going to do here? I'm going to... I'm going to uh, spend two supply to head down... Or Actually, before I do that, I'm going to drop one of my warbands off at the Lush Coast. Then I'm going to spend the two supply. Head over here, flip my secret. Then I'm going to play key to the city which the ruler's pawn is not at this site because it's the bandit site so i would kill off the warband and replace it with one of mine which doesn't count as a campaign so i don't have to flip another secret now i rule there and i'm also going to flip silver tongue which means i can only have two advisors but if i am uh in my rest i can take one favor from a favor bank matching a card at my site so Ah, this... silver tongue. Yeah, yeah, I saw yeah. the one. Either of those. Um, Discord's looking a little thin, but Beast is pretty healthy. Okay. Hmm. I really could use some favor. Hmm. Is it worth it to move back to the crate? Well. Yeah. Salt flats or the mine. And you you attacked the hidden place? I didn't attack it. I just used the key to the city. So it doesn't count oh. as a campaign. Hmm. Gosh, I really, really need the favor. And I can still take it. How's the hearth doing? There's still three in there, so I'll still get a favor from that. So I'm going to spend... Um, yeah, metal board in the chat saying the chancellor's looking a bit weak. Yeah, I made some really bad mistakes on turn two. <laughs> I'm not great at this game. This is still only my sixth game of this, so could be doing better. But I, I'm 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 trying my best. Um, so okay, I can probably get some favor there, and I'm gonna end it there, which means that I'll get to take from the hearth right about there then i have 10 war bands so we're gonna bump it back up to the 17-11 flip over my secret and then drop any favors or anything on the board in turn okay uh nothing happens during wake i think uh not right now oh no i'm gonna spend this secret to get two money uh, yep. Uh, 
on the Discord the last two. Oh boy. Yeah, I, I saw that one coming to an end. Alright. So then... Oh, that cost me one. Supply. I'm gonna spend two supply. Flip my secret to go to the hidden place. Metal board in the chat again says, you just trust your constituents to be peaceful. Currently, the citizen is my biggest threat, so I don't know how much I trust. I'm not a threat. I'm just a, a very happy citizen. Sure, <laughs> sure, sure. <laughs> For now. For now, yeah. But you're also, uh, for now, a, a nice chancellor. Mm -hmm, I think mm -hmm. I'm going to muster. And then, and then I go ahead. So that takes. Oh, I can't do that. No, nope, 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 nope. Feel Red is preparing for something. Hmm. Uh, I think I'm done preparing. And then I will will campaign. Okay. Uh, against, against the chancellor. Okay, so you're Chancellor's targeting the hidden anymore. place, which is going to cost you a secret, or what? You're going to have to flip a secret. Which no, did I, um, did you I, just I do that? that? Yeah, I'm okay. Gonna, I'm must, I'm uh, campaigning against the uh, blue exile. Okay, what are you targeting? Just the pawn? I'm I'm targeting his yeah his dowsing sticks. Dowsing sticks. Okay, that gets you three. Uh, Mr. Steve. Five, six, seven. And unfortunately, you don't rule any battle plans, Mr. Steve, so you just get the three, but that's that's already pretty good. And then, do you have any battle plans you want to use, uh, red? No, nope, I, don't, I don't control anything. Okay, so three against however many he wants to use there. Oh, it's going to be seven. All right, full force. Let's see how this goes. I mean, do you choose how many? I thought you had to use your... No, no, you can choose up to your full force. Keep in mind, each die has a chance of rolling a skull, so yeah. there, there's always the chance that you'll lose your full force doing it. Yeah, I think we do this. All right. Do we roll simultaneously, or...? Yeah, so Depend grab your seven. Well. You've got them set up. Yeah. yeah, right here. All right, whenever you're ready. Oof, yep, <laughs> just like that. So you lose four immediately. Yep. Mr. Steve has, let's see, six okay. plus the five on his board. That's 11 versus your uh, eight, nine, ten. So you got to do two more of your war bands after the four. If you want to be victorious. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yep. Wow. Yeah, not a great roll for you, but if you sacrifice those two, you'll still be victorious. Yeah, I got two because I'm going to lose half of them anyways. Yep. Alright, All right. so that means... Unfortunately, Mr. Steve, you got to lose two of your guys on your board. And you lose your dowsing stick. That was a slaughterhouse. Yeah, that was... Yeah, that was a lot. It's real rough. I don't think there would be that much blood for a little relic. Just, just for the complete picture, if um, he targeted the Oath Keeper, right? Mm -hmm. the, does the sprawling rampart uh, trigger? No, it only occurs when they're targeting sites. <clears throat> yeah, okay, So, uh, but if he uh, targeted the hidden place, it would. It would have, yes, because... Yeah. Yes. Okay. Alright, so I get... I don't have any more bands, so that's yeah. gonna go up there. That's the benefit of losing most of your force. You get uh, lots so, of supply. Yeah. Lots of force real, and when you have. Real quick problem. question. Sorry. Real quick question on that. Does that not apply to any campaign in the hidden place? Uh, well, let me see. I believe it's only when you target there. What's that? The uh, the hidden place. Declared campaign target. Oh. Actually, yeah, it's, the specific text is you cannot 
Declare campaign yes. targets here unless yes. you flip one secret. So actually, I don't believe you could have done that. No, I couldn't have. Well, Absolutely. shoot. Uh, well, all yeah. right. Take back your six. Okay, so Mr. Steve, you get your two back and your dowsing sticks. Uh, Red, you get your six warbands back. And you still have two supply. Yeah, thanks for pointing that out. The, the hidden place is really easy to forget. I don't know what the secret situation was for Red. What yeah, was, he had... Was, he, um, oh, right, he had I, one... I spent one here, and there, and then I flipped, flipped yeah. one. Flipped one, yep. I, didn't, I, I remember the move part, I didn't remember the campaign part. Yeah, that's that's always the easiest to forget. Yeah. Alright, so... <laughs> since the first he's on the card for the mnemonic purposes, but it's it's easy to forget. Uh, so I will do this. Okay. To get a secret. That cost me one. Yep. How about that? And then, I think I will just save my last one. So I have seven war bands, so I'm going to go up to nine because I didn't use my last one. Please go back to this core. And this goes back to me. Yep. Okay. And end turn. All right, Pale King, what do you got? Spend in two supply to search the hinterland. Yeah, thanks for watching, Stolen Vex. Hope you can come back in later. This might be a long game. We are currently on round three of possibly eight. All right, put one to the face down advisors. He's contemplating his shot. What's the plan? All right, checking the hinterlands again. What will he? How many are in the hinterland? It's I guess there were seven. seven. I think last check, yeah. yeah. So now just the one. That means well, there's going to be fifteen in the cradle. I should head over there. Hmm. I mean, I guess depending on how things shake out over the next three turns. All right, I'm putting one aside, maybe to the advisors. Yeah, that one's in the advisors as well. Yeah, metal board. Uh, Black doesn't have a mic, unfortunately, so I'm just going to kind of narrate whatever he's up to. Hmm, three more supply. What to do? Oh, sorting the advisors. Ooh, a plan is formulating. Oh, flipping two advisors. What do we got? Magician's code. An inquisitor. Just a question. Mm -hmm. If I say I would have three relics now, mm -hmm. can I be the oath keeper, or if I'm a citizen, that doesn't work? You can still be the oath keeper. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. It technically, it means the empire's oath keeper. Um, but you would get the plus one defense die in campaigns. 
right? It's as as long as he's uh not fighting you. Yeah. You get the, also, Black, you get um, you get two secrets for trading since you have two face-up uh, advisors. Oh, you used one. Yep, I got gotcha. you. I missed that. Sorry. Sorry. All right, and you're doing Magician's Code, which lets you take the darkest secret, or rather, if you take the darkest secret. And that means you get two from the supply to pay for it. Oof. Then the other two go back to Captain Badger. There they are on your board, Badger. Yep, thank you. All right, so he's hanging on to one secret put five on the darkest secret and it looks like that's the end of his supply could do any minor actions still all right mr steve all right well it looks like i'm gonna have to get the heck out of dodge here i will spend the two to depart Yeah, where we want to go. Hmm. Uh, and Decision. I'm actually going to hop away for just a moment, so I'll be right back. All right, I'll go up here to the salt flats. You guys are getting way too mean down there in the uh, hidden place. <laughs> I'll spend two more trying to trying to, to go in, to go into the deck. That's all the cards seem to be in the cradle. Cradle's the place to be. So many secrets. Yeah, these cards are all off. No wonder they were discarded. Ooh. All right. Yes. I'm going to play this card to the site. Tavern songs. Here, I'm going to help you guys out in the provinces and throw a couple cards over there. There you go. Have fun with those. Uh, I haven't uh, used tavern songs before. That's a free action on there. Real correct. Uh, yep. Alrighty. Oh, let me take my money from Hearth first. And then I will... Yeah, I'll take that action and look at the top three cards of the Cradle. Make sure I don't screw up their order. Alright, I'm back. Yeah, I know I've got these out of order, so... If you, if you peek a deck, does it peek the whole deck or just the top card? Uh, you would peek at the whole discard. Just the top. Right? And, uh, only that's the top, right? Uh, I can try with my advisors. Hmm. Yeah, who's only those the first let one. Me, let me check the law, see what it says. Uh, da -da -da -da. If 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 you do it, uh, tabletop simulator only uh, uh, peaks the f uh, uh, top card. It says all it says is look at the front side of the prompted cards, but do not reveal them to the table. Mm -hmm. So 
So I guess unless it specifically says the top card, if it says the deck, then you'd be able to look at the whole thing. I'll spend two to grab three more out of there. Found something you liked. And I am going to give that one to my advisors. Okay. Oh, nice. That's pretty good. I actually haven't seen that one. I think it's one that starts out in the archives. Help you guys out again in the provinces. Nice. And with my and with my last one, I will go ahead and muster. Uh, did you discard both your cards to the provinces? I'm only seeing one. It's not showing the number, even though there's more than one there. I don't know why. Yeah, sometimes it, it does that. Stacked. Specifically, the provinces, for some reason, do that. Hmm. I don't know about the hinterland. The cradle's okay. More than, is there more than one in the hinterland? Or? I'm, not think... getting a, I'm not getting a readout. Uh, okay, looks like just one there, one, and then two. provinces is one, two... There should be four, I think, because you did it twice. Four. Yeah. Yes, there's four. Then let me make sure I put those back in the correct order. Uh, now it shows. Yeah. Yeah, it shows. Maybe, maybe it was, maybe it was just a stacking issue. Sometimes, yeah. if they're a little out of alignment, they don't. Yeah, um, I guess so. Right. They don't snap. Yeah. Missed every chapter. now and then, you drop them onto a deck, and they just kind of go haywire. Mr. Chancellor, I have a proposition. Mm -hmm. uh, do you want me to clean up the cradle? I can clean it up a little bit. Because the cradle is a little bit crowded with denizens, in my, part, in my point, uh, opinion. Mm. And especially I would... the salt, fa salt flats get tidied up. That's true. I'm not necessarily a fan of Memory of Home. Uh, what does Tavern Songs do? Peak... Uh, Tavern Songs is okay, but yeah, Memory of Home we could get rid of. It's a little too pricey yeah, I, for what I, it does. I'm gonna get rid of them both. Both? Well, mm, okay. I'll, I'll, I'll allow that. I think Tavern Songs can go. And one in my, uh, in, in, in my, uh, site. Is this something you actually need permission for? No, I'm just, just, just... Yeah, it doesn't want to make any enemies. I would say, yeah, pretty much all of the... Uh, I already wanted to do it, but I'm just just confer conversing. Okay, so there both you go. you're gonna get rid of both of them at the salt flats, and you said one at plains as well. Yeah. Which one? Uh, the welcoming party. Ah, uh, I kind of like welcoming party right now. I know, mm. but it goes to the provinces discard, so it's for you to grab. That's true. That's true. I could just play it elsewhere. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I'd say... Uh, yeah, let's fine. do that then. Okay. I was already... That was already my plan, but... Just wanted to... Uh... Sure. I'm gonna play Dazzle. When played, discard all of the... Um, uh, cards in uh, Hearth and uh, Order in your region. And Order? Uh, oh man, that means rank No, it can't. That can't be discarded. Right, it cannot. Okay, so yeah, I guess we're just going all hard. So, welcoming party goes away. Memory of home goes away. And the tavern songs goes away. So, this is tidying up. <laughs> yeah, that yeah. That looks better. Okay. See, I want a permission from that, because it's pretty brutal. That, was, that definitely cleaned everything out. Yeah. So, all right. That was nice. Now, what are you going to yeah. do? Um, I'm gonna oh, I'm gonna place a favor on the people's favor. Ooh. Didn't do that yet. Yep. Sorry. Um, yeah, I'm guess I'm gonna search the deck at the cradle because I want something. Okay. All right, and don't and forget to spend your supply.
Hmm. What is he planning? I think I'm gonna play wolves to the side. Ooh. I'm getting a favor from the beast bank. Um... Oh boy. That could be helpful. That could be helpful, huh? Um, that was that. Then I'm gonna... Place this on the sprawling rampart. That gets me... Uh, so it means fire. What was Wolves attacks player board, right? Yes. Yep. Oh, two. Oh, that's three. Oh. Yeah, if it, it attacked the central map, it would say sight. Yes, yeah, sight or region. Yeah. Metal board in the chat says yellow doesn't seem to love his chancellor. <laughs> I'm getting, I'm getting that impression. No, I'm not gonna do it. Why? <laughs> don't love your chancellor. I don't know. You just seem to be, uh, seem to be putting yourself in a position. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> you never know, huh? That's the fun thing, uh, fun thing about this game. Um, yeah, I'm guessing I'm doing something else because um, I did this, but I don't want to be here actually. Um, because I don't get anything if I trade, because I don't have, um, I'm going to move to the mine, I'm gonna uh, peek at the relic. Hmm. Yeah, I'm gonna do that too, I forgot what that was. Oh, I haven't I haven't even looked at it yet on any of my turns. <laughs> um I'm gonna get the relic. Okay. So yeah, so I'm it's spending three, them to the three to Discord. All right, which now you are tied for most relics and banners, which Oathkeeper holds on to it until you uh, get at least one ahead. Yep. Wow, that seems strong. Yeah, that's one of the most popular ones. Uh, wait, I moved. And not just because it's a cute little piece. I traded. Yeah. I searched. Yeah, then it's, uh, this is right. Um... Okay, um, yeah, I'm just, just trying to grasp what I need to do. Um, I'm going to do the action of the octocular pig. I'm going to uh, look at the top three. Sure. Okay, that was nice to see. <laughs> um, uh, 
if I pass, I'll get this back, right? Yeah, I do. And then I'm going to pass. Okay. And so we are at, well, we're, yeah, in the second to last, and then you get the plus two because you saved them. All right, Captain Badger. Gonna get my secret back, by the way. Oh, yep. I will spend one to trade with Discord. Okay. So I only get one, but I need it. So. And then I am going to flip this guy face up. Ah, playmates! So I will muster at the old oak, spending no supply. Ah, good. And now I will spend two to search this card. Hmm. Vision. That one goes. And I'm going to get rid of my playmates. And put this one in face down instead. So, now I'm going to... move out of the hidden place and it doesn't cost extra to leave it just costs extra yeah to just to go uh well actually let me double check that yeah is this uh, specific move it says move in. Uh, fertile valley is the yes. one that costs you to leave yeah it says or, to travel to the, the hidden place yeah. specifically okay. so, i spent one to trade i spent two to search so two to travel and I will come out here. And I will play this guy to the site. All right, so that gets you one for him and yep. one more and for one. the Fertile Valley. One more for it. And if somebody hadn't killed the welcoming party, <laughs> no. there's, only two in there. there's only two in there anyway. Sorry. Uh, that's the way it goes. Um, I needed to. So now, I can play games with the cards that are here. I will... Oh yeah, Metal Board, I'll definitely do that. My turn's coming up next, so... I will use this action and take one from... I guess I'll just take one from Arcane. Use that one I got from Arcane. Do this in a secret, and that ends my action then because of the card. Right. So I regain the secret. Goes back to Arcane. I am at seven. And then I have one left over, so I go up to nine. Yep. Oh, also there's a secret and a favor at the hidden place. Were those yours? Oh, yes. Yes, I mustered and... Okay. So that goes to the beast. Oh. And that should be it. All right, round four. So start off, I get this favor right here from the mine, then 
uh, something Metal Board reminded me of in chat. Uh, Yellow, I'd like two of your warbands from your board. I could get those. Oh, can you? Really? Yeah, can get them then. Yeah, we can trade the. It'll still keep it. We're, we're still tied up for warbands doing that. Just wanted to do that before I moved, which will be. Uh, or, ooh, actually. Do I want to move right away? Or do I want to gain two? So, you know what? Mm, now I could really use the favor right now. So I'm just going to move to the lush coast. And then I'm going to search for two in the province's discard. So we got. Hmm. Mm. Well, that's not super helpful to me. Uh, so I will play Grasping Vines. Now, anytime any of my enemies, which doesn't include the citizen, since he's part of the Empire, moves from uh the Lush Coast, you have to kill one warband on your board if you have any. And that gets me a beast favor. Not only from the Lush Coast. From every Enemy. side that's ruled by us. Enemies Charlie from any site ruled by us. Oh. Yep. Okay, so, so yeah, never mind. Basically, better. so if you move from the hidden place, the tribunal, the planes, the, the anything in the cradle. Cold okay, yeah. that's even more brutal than I thought it was. <laughs> well. It's <seems> horrible. <laughs> I'll, I'll accept that. That's That works for me. Um, okay. Nice one. And... Since I'm here, I may... Well, wait, actually, how many warbands do I have left? Ten, so... Do I want to save those up? Yeah, I'm going to stop there, so I go back up to ten, plus the two I saved. Uh, didn't put anything out there, and since I'm in my... Re oh, wait, before I forget, got to discard these. To the hinterland. Uh, no, to the hinterland. Come on, come on. There we go. And did these do anything? Uh, no, not trading. Okay. So, yep. And then I get to do silver tongue, which means that I get to take one favor from the beast bank. And that is the end of my turn. Okay. Oh, let's see here. Three cards, eh? Yeah. Cool, cool. No. Alright, we're gonna trade with the key to the city. Some two favor. And muster. Okay, spend two to move. All right, and as with yep, grasping vines, yep. All right, and then spend the last two to campaign against yellow. Um, I'm just uh. You don't rule here, so I don't have to attack the site, so I'm just attacking the oracular pig. All right, that gets yellow two dice. Uh, does longbow supply? Uh, yeah, you rule it because it's in your advisors, so it will be a minus one, one attack best. dice. Okay. Uh, so I defend with two or with five? Uh, you defend with two, and then... Okay, not my warband. And then um, red gets to choose how many attack dice. Again, going all in. All right, Four. so you'll only get seven because longbow subtracts one from you. Four, six, seven. All right. Much better roll. Yes. All right, that's times two Aww. to nothing. 
since you're attacking him, he gets the three, and you already got six, so you win that. Bad. So one of your war bands dies. Yellow goes back to my bag. Oh, whoops. And the, the hor and pig goes. Yep, red gets the pig. You pig. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you got this. Fair and square. Bad. Uh, then I might as well use the ability on it. All right. Oh, yeah, yeah. Look Which at if it. you'd That's... like, you could just draw all three and then put them back. Yeah. Put them back in the same order? Yeah. <laughs> oh boy. Yeah. I know, right? I'm not saying anything, but. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I saw them. I know. And there are four favor on the people's favor? Yep. Okay. Oh, no, don't do that. Flip them back over first. Metal board says that'll do, pig. That'll do, pig. Nice. <laughs> Which is a double reference because it's clearly supposed to be Henwin from the Black Cauldron. Yes. Get that back, get that back. And... Yeah, I so wish that Black Cauldron was better. It was originally going to be a much more interesting movie, but then it got really chopped up to death by uh, Jeffrey Katzenberg when he came into Disney. Uh, White, did you uh, place the Dinkus Fair there? Yes. Okay, nice. You opened up the banner of uh, Dark Secret. What, what, what did you I, open? I had that, I had that thought. <laughs> yeah, you opened up the banner of the Darkest Secret because uh, not any card at the site matches his advisors. It did until you played the Tinker's Fair because he has arcane cards at the site and Correct. arcane cards in his hand, yep. but not a harp. Oh. So now it's open for grabs if you got six. Yeah, if you got six secrets. Yeah, if you've got six yeah, secrets. That's a lot, but still, it wasn't open until now. Hmm. Oh, the grasping veins is nice. I know, yeah. Just a nice addition. I know, it makes me wish this was the uh, supremacy, because then we, we'd be well ahead. Yeah. Although, as long as I can hold Oathkeeper for two more rounds, it might might end up being good for us. Oh, and yeah, of course, the successor will win if I don't get that people's favor away. Or really, anybody could get the people's favor away. Hmm. Well, I missed the entire first half of Black's turn here, so... Hmm. Looks like a lot of trading. Some mustering. Yep. I could always exile yellow first, but it would behoove me to take the people's favor because then I will have a, a two banner and relic lead for the oath keeper so it's definitely helpful for me plus it's much harder for the citizen to campaign against me if he's still a citizen hmm 
what does Inquisitor do? Let me check that. Let's see, peek at an advisor of a player whose pawn is at your site. So white, he's going to peek at one of your advisors. If it's the conspiracy, you can play it or discard it. If it is not, then you get a favor, which looks like that was the case. Okay. Yeah, the conspiracy can be very useful in this particular game, which is why that vision that yellow is holding on to concerns me a little bit. And the last, the river. Okay, no, no relics. But the river, I believe, if you muster, you get an extra. Yes, you get three warbands if you muster at the river. If you rule it. If you rule it? Let me double check that. That's what the site reference is. If you rule this site, correct. So All currently, right. that's well, the bandits. And then I'm going to spend two to get out of dodge, losing a warband. Maybe. No. He doesn't want to get back in the bag. He doesn't rule it. Or, oh, yeah, he does rule that one. Yeah, so he's, got, he's got a yep. character. Yeah, let's separate those little bits. It's a little easier to read. And I am going to go here to a place he doesn't rule. And I will spend that favor to get two supply back. Mm. And then I am going to spend two to search this deck. Hmm. And I am going to play. Um, you did get rid of the warband when moving from salt flats, right? Yes. Okay, okay. Yes, I had seven. I'm down to six. Sorry, I was texting my brother, so I wanted to make sure I didn't miss anything. Oh, let's scoot the darkest secret. There we go. And let's see here. I'm in the provinces, so this goes to the hinterlands. I will spend to move. I'm going to come down here to the Fertile Valley. I have eight bands in the bag. Plus one goes to nine. All right. I'm glad you're That's enjoying good. the stream, Halfway Hero. I, I definitely do hope to stream Oath more often. It's kind of difficult in the setup since I have to like put my phone up on a mic stand to be able to hear the Discord, but this is my sixth game of it, and I'm enjoying it a lot. And I hope to do some like IRL ones once I get the physical version. Sorry for uh, interrupting you there, Mr. Steve. No, nope, you're fine. I was just doing cleanup. Okay, okay. Okay. Um... I'm over there. I get a favor. Yep. That favor goes to the people's favor. Uh, yeah, yeah, you can do it that way. Yeah, I, I had one on my board as well, so it doesn't matter. Um, the halfway hero asks, "How is the six-player experience compared to three to four? What do you guys think?" It's it's complicated. Way more complicated because you have to look at all the players now. With three yesterday, it was pretty easy because everyone had his own spot, and now everyone is everywhere. So that's true. It's really hard to well, keep keep track of everyone. Yeah, it's but very it's, it's nice because it's uh, there's not much ganging up on some uh, on one 
someone. If I was a citizen in a three-player game, you know, we're both going against the exile or against the Commonwealth. Yeah, it definitely feels a lot more crowded, but I kind of like yeah. that. Yeah, yeah. And when you when you have three or four, everyone could, in theory, be working toward a different victory condition too. But when you get five or six, there aren't enough visions plus existing oath to go around. So that changes the dynamic a little bit. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, and so far it's looking like it's longer because we're about an hour, 40 minutes in now on round four. Um, is there something weird to Fertile Valley? I can just move there and move out, right? It's not. Yeah, uh, Fertile Valley's thing is if you play a hearth card to it, you get an additional favor yeah, from okay. the hearth bank. Or actually, is it from the bank? It might be from the supply. Let me check. Uh, if it's yeah. from supply, there should be another one in the hearth. Because I took it's from it's from the bank, supply. so That's, it's all yeah. good. Yep, halfway hero confirms as well. It's the bank. Okay, I'm gonna move to the tribunal. Okay. It cost me two supply. I'm gonna uh, uh, take the action over there. Okay. Let's draw a relic and take it. Yep. In this case, since you don't have any other relics. And what did you get? It's the ivory eye. Ooh. Well, no more face down sites, but the advisors. Yeah, so That's I can pick really uh, the advisor of some one, right? Yes, any pawns that are at your site, you can peek at their advisors now. That pawns, yeah. yeah. Metal board says, looks like it's time to reprimand yellow. Oh, it's getting there. <laughs> I, I'm, I'm planning it, something. Maybe I have a card up on my sleeve, you never know. Um, I mean, I don't even have arms, it's just a hand. Halfway Hero suggests going wild on Tribunal and making temporary alliances, coordinated attacks, and conspiracies. Maybe we will. Maybe. Um, I'm going to move to the Fertile Valley. All right. Going to cost me three. Mm -hmm. I'm going to, um, wait, you can't. So why do we think the Fame Merchant doesn't, doesn't put that away? Um... Well, because it doesn't say then, it implies that it's any relic you currently hold when you draw it. So, the, the, my interpretation is that it's basically any of your current relics would go under the deck, but since there are none, then you wouldn't. So it allows you to draw one if you have zero, but after that it cycles. Basically, yeah. I'm, I'm not going to move there, sorry. I'm okay. going to um, draw some cards <laughs> from the Interlands. Halfway Hero suggests uh, we have enough players to have an exile alliance. So if you exile players wanted to get to the tribunal and make some kind of an alliance. Make some sort of a binding.
Um, I'm gonna play the welcoming party to my side, and I'm gonna discard the Fey Merchant. Okay. Um, the uh, secret goes back to my board then, right? It will at the end of the turn. Yeah, just fl just flip it over yep. to show that it's just being used. Just flip it face down, yep. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. True. All right. Okay. And so you then only I'm get the... Uh, one yeah. The That'll only take effect um, in future yeah, turns. Yeah, for the second one. Yeah. Yeah, but uh, wait. Uh, when playing my first discard. Yeah, maybe I will do that again. Yeah, I will do that again. Okay. Oh, I first had to discard. I'm gonna play the memory of home over there. I'm gonna discard okay. the card that was there. Um, I'm gonna get one from the hearth. Uh, I'm actually gonna get two from the hearth, but there's only one. Right. Um, yeah, and then I'm gonna discard those to the other one. All right. And then I'm gonna uh, trade over there. Oh no, I can't. Shit. <laughs> ah, then I'm uh, passing, and I get to the leftmost space because I saved one. Yep. <sighs> All right, Captain Badger. He got mm. a lot of secrets. Yes, I do. Not enough, though. Not quite. What is it? I think Wizard School lets you get one, doesn't it? Yeah. Oh, but you wouldn't be able to recover until next turn. Yeah, yeah. It's... Just to be sure, uh, the banner of people's favor says if this banner has six plus. So it's six and over or more than six? Six or more. Six or more. So basically okay. if... Um, next if... turn I put one on it, it flips. Uh, yes. Yes, it will. If you two, continue to two. have it at that point. Hope you don't mind. I put that question in the rules chat. Not that I don't believe you. Oh, let me see. Yeah, good to keep up with that. I do the spirit snare. And I can take it from anywhere. I'll get one from the nomads. And then... I'm going to go back to the provinces. That cost me two. Yep. And I have to flip a secret. Then I will trade with the old oak. Or. Two secrets because I have acting troop. Uh, did, did you come from the Fertile Valley? Was that your secret? Yes. I, yeah. Okay. That was my first. My first action was. Thought so. Okay. Dealing with that guy. But I'll take two secrets. And that trade, which cost me another one. 
Okay, Hung Kong in the rules chat says uh, that you keep it. You put back any other relic you might have had before using Fey Merchant. If you had none, you lose nothing. So, the way we were playing it. Cool. And yeah, Metal Board confirmed uh, six or more for the people's favor to flip to the mob side. What are librarians? I think he's saying. Oh. Then? Yeah. Oh, I always figured the yellow citizen because they got the book. Huh. I could see it both ways. Another two to travel. Actually, he has a lantern, so maybe. And I'm going to head over. Yeah, and you lose uh, a war band since you uh, yeah. moved from a site that I ruled. Yeah, losing a war band. <laughs> and that will end my turn. So I'm at eight, and I've got one left, so I go to nine. I call the Muppet. Please go to the Beast. Yep. He's back to me. Oh yeah, that's seven secrets now. And that, that, that's, that's some stockpiling you're doing there. And I believe that's all the cleanup. <coughs> Alright, so now we're in round five. If I'm Oathkeeper by the end of this round, I can roll to win. So, let's see here. What is my plan? Hmm. Well, I can't draw very easily, so that's unfortunate. I only really get one from here. Uh, well, you know what? I'm going to spend two, move to the plains, trade with wolves. So that's another there, which gets me. Or nope, not wolves. Uh, the the disgraced captain, which gets me two more favor. Then I'm gonna spend another one to recover the people's favor. We're gonna drop, ooh, where do we wanna put this? I think hearth is coming through quite well. So let's start, actually let's start at arcane. I, eh, you know what, actually discord can help me a good deal. So let's, yeah, hearth, then beast, then nomad, it, whoop, whoop, uh oh, uh, nomad, Discord, Arcane. Then I put my six on there. It's not my wake phase yet, so it's not going to flip until my next wake phase. All right. You just got that for me. <laughs> All right, and oh, whoop. flip that around. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Favorite's going going wild. Okay. And then, how many is in here? 11. I have the people's favor now, so I can discard as needed. Which one would I want to discard? Probably Disgrace Captain. It's a little pricey, and I don't really plan to do much attacking. So I'm going to spend two to search the cradle discard. All right, what do we got? Hmm. Could be good, could be good. Oh. Yeah, I'm gonna switch out Disgraced Captain. And drop in Mountain Giant, which gets me a Nomad favor. 
And I get my secret back. So that's going to get discarded to the provinces. Um, well, and these do as well. Yeah. There we go. And that's all of my supply. Are there any free actions I could do? Nope, nope. Mm, don't have that. Not over there. Uh, oh, and also because I did that, I get a welcoming party, which gets me the last hearth favor. I uh, can't do that, and I don't rule there. Okay, so yeah. Um, oh, and Metal Board says, uh, you also don't have to flip it on your turn. You can just put one favor onto a favor bank. That's true, yeah. I can either... I, I do have the option first to put one of these to a favor bank, and then it's only five. But then it, I only... Well, five dice to protect it is still pretty good. Um, okay, so that is my turn. Flip that back over. I have 11 warbands. Did I drop anything on cards? Nope. All right. End turn. Red. All right, so... Nope, nope. Spend a favor to gain two supply. All right. Um, Iggy? Yes? You need to look at your advisors, uh, Black says. Hmm? Oh, yep, and I also... That's right. I can take a favor from one of those. I'm going to go with... Does order it? to empty it out. Okay. Matching a card at your side. Oh, yeah, okay. Yep. <clears throat> yeah, which unfortunately means I can only have one more advisor, but I've only needed the one for the most part. Here, let's get these out of my hand. Draw these. Might as well, right? Take one from any favorite bank. All right. Uh, I'll gain another favor from. Um, is there any left? On uh, nope. That ain't gonna Ooh. work. Uh, I'm going to step away again. I'll be right back. Trade. I'm sorry, muster. All the armies. Uh, and I guess spend two to campaign against blue. Again, for your dowsing stick. I don't have enough dice. I have 11 warbands. <laughs> oh, maybe I'm maybe I kind of wrong. Hold on. Two, four. Is there a way to snap these into, like, clean lines? Uh, I'm not sure. 
I mean, I watch, there, there probably is. I just don't know yeah. how to do it. You see, yeah, you I, can. If you just pick them up, yeah. If you select them, pick them up, and then press one to uh, number. Ah, okay. So that's three, six, nine, ten. So it's just ten. So yeah, go all how again. Many guys there. Are. Yep. Another uh, war band or something? Another uh, battle plan? No. Okay. Nope. I don't have any battle plans. Blue has though. Oh yeah, which is the minus one dice? Yeah, yeah. or the mercenaries. Plus one defense. You have extra provisions also if they want. No, oh, you can't do that. He doesn't have the money for it. Oh, the mercenaries also cost money. Yep. So you okay. can't. Are you just rolling the... So, Dowsing Sticks has... Three. And then three Warbands. So, plus three. He's got six. Six Warbands. Oh, okay. Cool. Should be a good time, then. All right, ready when you are? So I immediately lose two. And then blue has ten. Uh, so one, two. And I've got two, four, five. Five and a half. Five, six, seven, eight. Eight. Eight, eight on half. the dice. So I need to sacrifice three more to get it. That's a lot. I mean, mm. my supply thanks me. That went a lot better than last time, at least. Yeah, it was actually legal. <laughs> <laughs> that too. So then blue loses three. <clears throat> Excuse me. All right, so then, yeah, I'm just going to immediately do that. Okay. Why not? Let's make this a little spicy. Yeah. Get some action going. That will get you tied up with me. Yes. So, draw one relic. Oop. What do we get? We got a map. Map. What does that let you do? I have to get. I have to burn. I literally have to burn it to use it. Rip. Well, it gets you four supplies. So that'll be pretty useful. Should you right. get an, enough to be ahead? Yeah. Actually, uh, what so does mine even do? I might have been wasting something. That it... is my last. Oh, I did. Yeah, I didn't have to. Uh, I didn't have to yeah. use a supply to trade with the Discord. Yeah. Oh well. All right, so I have five left. So we're gonna go here. I get this back. And then that's it. All right, the Pale King. Keep an eye on what he's doing. I'm looking at a war band. Oh yeah, this goes back too. No, spending three, moving up to the Fertile Valley. What are you going to do? I guess you could do some great trading. Spending one, yep, trading with Arcane. Gets three from that bank. Yeah, that was a strong argument for triggering Memory of Home and just getting that magic off there. Mm, yeah.
Halfway Hero says, I'm surprised no visions have been played. Me too, honestly. At least three of y'all have them. Or maybe those are conspiracies. I, I couldn't play it because I'm a citizen. Oh, yeah, so you're hanging on to something. Yeah. Halfway Hero also says, Usually around uh, turn five, the whole game devolves into chaos. That's been my experience too. Rounds four and five are where things go really off the wall. Metal Board makes a good point. Everyone is afraid to become a target, which, yeah, I always equate the visions to the uh, dominance cards in Root. It's like, it's temporary and you can replace it and stuff, but it still makes you a big target because you can win in one turn. But you can't replace them in Root. Hmm? You can't replace them in Root. That's what I'm saying. You can replace them here, unlike Root. Yeah. Sorry, I yeah, okay. misspoken. All right, Mr. Steve. Yeah, you feel harmed, huh? Without your dowsing sticks. Yeah. That was that. That was a hard move. Yeah, Red really wanted it. Alrighty, I am going to. First thing I'm going to do is trade. All right. Over here at Tinker's Fair. And I will take two. What's that? I'm just thinking out loud, sorry. Oh, okay. I wasn't gonna... I'd sound like a question. No, I'm gonna spend those two on elders. Okay. What does that do again? Oh uh, okay. And then I will use that to trade on Spirit Snare. Spend that one on Wizard Academy and grab one more. Mm -hmm. Then you need to end your turn, right? Yes. All right. Is that the end of your turn? Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay. <laughs> Renny. Uh, I will put a favor on the people's favor. Oh, no, I can't because someone took it from me. <laughs> 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 <sighs> Such a brutal move. Such a brutal move. Um, I'm going to... I'm going to move. Actually gonna move here, so that cost me two. Metal board says gonna... all of the lowborns are in the hinterlands, which I think he means exiles. Yeah. And I'm gonna spend a supply of a uh, thing there, and I get my two supply back. Right. And I'm gonna move over there and spend the supply again. Then I'm gonna draw a card from the cradle.
and apply this to the okay. side. Hmm. Getting oh, another one from the order bank. Too bad. Well, that's a little um, weird for a battle plan, but all right. Yeah. Then I'm gonna draw again. Oh wait, already over there. I'm going to play the Fey Merchant to my side. Ah, you got that. All right. I get one Beast Favor over there. going to play the Secret over there. I'm going to take one Relic. All right, which means you're going to have to put the Ivory Eye away. Uh, yeah. Oh, then I have to do this, right? All right, and what'd you get? It's the horned mask. Ooh. That's nice. Yeah, that could be really useful. Yeah, I know what exactly what I'd do with it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I will put two favor on the scouts on the trade. Right. That's my uh, last supply for that. Then I'm gonna get a secret. I'm putting the secret on the uh, orange mask, and I'm gonna uh, play this one up there, and then I'm gonna get the. Dazzle again. <laughs> uh, does it trigger now? Yeah. Uh, it does it say it says swap? It's just a swap. I don't think so it's a swap. Let, let me right? check. It doesn't trigger. Yeah. Let me check the the glossary here. Guess not. Yeah, no, it's not being played. Yeah, it's not being played. It would be my guess. That wouldn't be mine as well. Yeah, just switching locations. It does not say that it gets triggered again. No. I'm getting all my secrets back. <laughs> Turning this to the order bank. I'm gonna put this to there. I'm gonna end my turn. Okay. <laughs> All right. Well, All right. let's do this. Two to travel, which flips a secret. Upside down. Then I'm going to trade with the old oak. Uh, black is proposing a truce. White. Uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> Not no threat. Then I will spend one to recover the darkest secrets. Yeah. There it is. And I'll put all eight on there. Oh, wow. So. I I agree with. He gets. I don't want gets, to be the Commonwealth anymore. He gets four. He and I get one. Me. Yeah. Self exiling is a little bit expensive. Actually, is it? It's. Yeah, it's. Oh, it cost me two. Well, I doubt Pleasure. the White's vision is the conspiracy metal board because then no, we four. need to keep getting all these secrets. Yeah. And uh, yeah, I guess I know what his see what his vision is. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. His favorite. Oh man. Also nine secrets that Black has. So 
that was one to recover. I mm -hmm. had to pay. And then, um, yeah, no sense. Uh, yeah, um, there it is. And I will you and kill a warband to leave. Sure. And spend my last two to get go out. back to the river. Okay. So uh, now I have nine warbands in the bag, so I go up to there. These two go to the beast. Flip my secret. Oh. I put a target on my back, that and then I'm done. the hearth. There we go. Okay, so now, since I was still Oathkeeper, it's time to roll. Uh, let me... Yes. No get... six! All right, if it's a six, I win right here. It's two. No. All right. Let's go! Round s uh, s s s six. Round six. <laughs> All right. That's a relief. Whew. All right. So my biggest threat right now is that vision of faith. So how much... Gosh, that's going to have eight dice. That's that's pretty pretty difficult. I could try and get the conspiracy, uh, but that's assuming neither red nor purple have it, or uh, yellow. Sorry, that's a but citizen. But the conspiracy says something on it, right? What's that? You know what the conspiracy says, right? Uh, okay. no, not off the top of my head. You have to have yeah. two matching advisors. Oh, yeah. but two have at least two, two advisors that match any of theirs, even if the two of yours, yours match only oh, one of theirs. Oh, okay, so conspiracy so would not be... So you need to have be... two arcane. Yep, and I can't with the silver tongue, because I can only have one more anyways. Nope. So okay. That work. So that's no good for me. Hmm. So what can you trade? Can you trade advisors? Using, like, Tinker? No. No. No, relics, money, or secret. Yeah. Oh, boy. Well, let's see. Uh, well, first off, it's my wake phase, so I gotta remove a favor. Uh, which one I think Discord has the least, correct? Yes. Um, okay. And... Let's see. Well... I think I will leave it to Black to deal with that, because he actually has enough secrets to do it, and he will lose just as much as I will if that happens. So I'm going to focus on Red, who's really trying to take take all these relics away. So what can I, what I, you're talking about. What can I do to stop that? Well, you're pretty far away. Hmm. So be four just to get over there. Well, you could just run away, too. Oh, man. Okay, so what I'm going to do first off is I'm going to... I'm going to... Mm, what are my options here? I, I'm going to trade two favor... Oh, no, there's no Discord here. Crap, where'd it go? Uh, Okay. <laughs> I'm going to spend two. Come on. What did where go? Spend two to go to the hidden place, which I'm going to have to flip my secret. And then I'm going to trade with key to the city to get a secret. Whoop, 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 whoop. That gives, that's one more supply. Then I'm also going to muster the wolves, which is another one. And I will hang on to that last supply, I think. So that's five warbands on my board. I'm going to go up to 17-11 with the one I saved. And then I can take from Beast or Discord. I'm going to take from Discord. And that, that's my turn. 
Oh, that's right. Wait a minute. I didn't need to spend any supply on the trade. Uh, so, okay, I'm just going to say that I would have banked that as well. So just one more up. Easiest solution here. No, no for your silver tongue. I did that one. Yep, that's where I got this favor here. Perfect. Thank you for the reminder, middle board. All right, so it's my turn. Yeah. Not much matchy matchy. Uh, do that for free. And it's any bank, right? Yep. Yep, any one of your choice. Hearth actually has some. Not great, but I don't think I'm going to move either. Uh, I'm mine as well. Reveal that. Oh, uh, what do you got? Relics banners? Well, I guess that means that you win in one turn. Rather than yeah. having to wait to become usurper. Correct. Okay. I mean, it's pretty obvious I'm trying to win anyways, so I might as well oh, yeah. step it up a bit. Uh, and then, yeah, let's do it. Draw another relic. Oh, thanks for following Babylon me. I hope you're enjoying the stream. He's got it, so... Earn the favor. Hmm? Yeah, it's burning the favor. Yep. And then skeleton key. Oh man. Whoa. Oh that my god. Thankfully he doesn't have any secrets. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. All right. I just got a second one. Well, you do become yeah. oath keeper now that you have one more relic than I do. Uh, so I will gain one from naysayers. How's that work? I actually can get from you. That's a nice turnaround from that. Poo. Okay. Right. Well, that doesn't happen until your rest. Yeah, so it took two supply there. Uh, do I want to move? Do I want to draw? There's nothing to draw. Yeah. If only you had the darkest oh, wait, secret. Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> I can... Uh, I spend my last three to move here, which you do run. Right. And then I can skeleton key. Well, no, you gotta you gotta use a favor and burn a favor. Whoop! Nope, nope, not into my hand. Yeah, actually, let's let's not do that. Let's just sit tight. Okay. Force the play. All right. So, uh, I have five war bands, and I boop boop boop. Okay. So yeah, then I take the favor from you. So white is the next person in line to win, unless somebody can get the darkest favor away. And then red. Yeah, <laughs> black will. <laughs> All right, Pale King. Pale King's just playing Kingmaker right now. It's like, who, does, who do they want to let win? Anything I can do to incentivize it being me. <laughs> I'm, I'm all ears. All right, so Pale King is probably going to get more secrets just to do the recover so that they don't completely run out of secrets, but... Oh? Trading. Okay. I don't think I'm susceptible to it being recovered, am I? Because there are no cards at the site that... Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah. No way. There's no cards at all. Yeah, you're completely yeah. safe. That's why, I, that's why I went there. Oh, and thank you for following Metal Board. <laughs> There's no cards there, because the Interlands is completely empty. 
Yeah, yeah or it costs four uh, things, but it's just too much. So actually, White's gonna win now. Metal Board says he needs to move to the river, put an advisor down somehow, then recover. Yeah, it's too late now. Yeah. Yeah, there's no way to get an. I don't know. I don't know how you get an advisor there. Yeah, I know. I know. I mean, honestly, yeah, it seems like I... the only wait, way wait, to wait, go wait. here. Wait, um, Black, wait. Uh, can I reveal things about cards? Can uh, I let tell me, things about cards? Let me check here. Uh, it says private information. Players card who know card private card. information can describe it, but can lie and cannot reveal the card. So you can't show him the card, but you can say what it is, and it's up to him whether or not he trusts you. Okay, so I can say what I know. Okay. I'm allowed. Okay. Yes. Black, if I were you, I would search the deck, the world deck. Oh, Cause yeah, because you've seen cat. the top three. Yeah, and I know what the first one is. Yeah. yeah you so want that. He'll only get the vision, this. but... Uh, it costs four. I, you, well, you I'd recommend... I, well, okay. I, w I would recommend getting the Darkest Secret first, if you can, just because then you only have to spend two supply. Yeah, he can't. He can't. That's the problem. That's the problem. He can't. Cause, uh, oh, right, because no you've got to match up. And there's no way to do it but he um it was uh it is the conspiracy it's and he has two matching advisors to the advisor at white oh so okay with the conspiracy he can take the darkest secret well yeah sounds like he's gonna i it just moved the like uh that. vision tracker no, no oh, problem yeah. huh problem is he can't move to my site plus three do you need to be at sight? I don't think you need to be at the sight for the conspiracy. <laughs> no, I guess not. Let me double check. Let me double check if you need to be at the site. Did you didn't. Travel to their pawn site. Yeah, that does say it has to be at your site. No! Oh no, and there's not going to be enough. Shoot. Ah, uh, no, wait, um... It's three to move. Can't you, wait, wait, wait. Can't you travel to the, um, uh, mine? Then spend a, a favor there, get to supply, and then get back. No, no, you're, you're still zero. No, wait, yeah. it's one cheaper. That'll you just... can. Yeah, it is. Because it, you gain... If you go to the mine, you lose two supply. But you gain two supply from the wayside in. But if you go from the provinces to the hinterlands, it only costs two, not two. three. Yep. So you can. <laughs> it's cheaper oh, to go to the mine, yeah, they'll then cancel go back itself to out. the... It's not cheaper, you just have the ability to gain two. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, you're gonna yeah, end Yeah, and then up... you get to supply, and then you can move over there. That conspiracy needs to be placed face down as one of your advisors. Yeah, but you can discard an advisor, that's not You problem. can't discard a face-up advisor. Yes. You can't? Yes, you can, unless it has a... That's what the... Unless, it's, unless it's locked. Yeah. Hold on a minute. I I guess I got that wrong. Let me check. Um, yeah, that's what the chains are. The, the, that locks it. Let's see. Where would that be in? What you could. It's in this. I believe it's in the search section of the rule. It's okay. Uh, you can have up to three advisors face up or face down. If you are playing an advisor that would exceed your advisor limit, you must first discard an advisor, and then in parentheses, you cannot freely discard face up advisors unless prompted to. But but you can now because you draw so through it. Prompt. Yeah, but he's prompted because he couldn't uh, otherwise place it. I hmm. Otherwise, the conspiracy doesn't go anywhere. Oh, okay, I get it. So sorry, they don't mean that as in part of that action. That's why it's in parentheses. They just mean generally you can't right. just throw away General, a face of advisor. Right. Yeah, but he you, has to now. Okay. If you're sitting with two, you can't just toss. Awesome. But okay. It'd be advantageous, okay. like it'd be in his, like white as an exile, getting rid of his magic. Yeah. Uh, yes. Got it. I misunderstood. I misunderstood okay. that that particular rule. Okay. 
So you can now, right? So now you can play the conspiracy. Uh, burn a secret. Burn uh, a secret. I I don't think I can unless we're at Tinker's Fair. T yeah, what? Tinker's Fair or the Tribunal. Oh right, you rule it, so you can take that as an action. Uh. Yeah, I feel like that benefits me. Okay. Uh, Burn Swan playing this conspiracy. Right. Okay. Yeah, that does it. Then we just <laughs> conspiracy gets wow. out of the game. No problem, Get out of here. No problem. No, wait. <laughs> nope. Come on. Jeez Get out of here. Yeah. Sorry. Sorry, White. That was not Sorry. Very, very good stuff. Make, I had to make a play. No. Get out of here. I needed to. I needed to help. I guess. Yeah. You you've got the entire board friggin' hustling. That's for sure. <laughs> okay. So now. That was fun. <laughs> now we got to worry about red. Yeah. Yeah. That's the. F yeah, and you. <laughs> I mean. Secrets? Do all the secrets go with it? Uh, no. Um, the person who had it before gets to keep all of those secrets. But is this a is this a recovery or is it just a straight up theft? Uh. Oh, actually, yeah, I believe that would be a seize. So. Yeah. So I had two. Oh here. wait, metal board says no, no. So it's a seize, so yeah, two of those get burned. Uh, yeah, you have to burn two. That's correct. Okay, but other yeah, you get the other six, or no, you get the other five. He gets one. Yeah, true. All right. Well, that was interesting. That, that was, was interesting. That was a very, very intriguing turn. That was the, that was really the only way. Yeah, that was a puzzle. Now, Blue, right. I would say if you could, you could campaign against Red to take one of those relics. Now, I'm gonna, I'm gonna trade right there on Tinker's Fair and take both these hearts. Sure. And then I will. Yes. Oh, uh, Black, by the way, you're not the one who burns it. It's uh, two of the ones that were already on the secret. Yeah, you there should... were eight on there. Uh... Oh, that adds up to. Yep, that adds up to ten. You are correct. All right, well, I think I can only do this once. So I will muster. All right. I wanted that conspiracy, but there was no way I could get the matching advisors. Yeah, same. Me neither. It was my play all along, but yeah. Because I would, I, I wanted to take the Grand Scepter, so he couldn't exile me. <laughs> oh, how do I want to do this? All right, let's just then, get it. Then he took the people's favor, so that was horrible. All right. And then I will, of course. Campaign against Red for one of those relics he's got over there. Okay, which one do you want? Oh! <clears throat> what? No. The key? The key seems like a good move. Well, the pig has two dice, the key has three dice. Yeah. Oh, that's a good point. Yeah. But that, that key is really useful. Why are you? You don't want him stealing your relics. Does so if if he triggers that, do you get to use your relic board perk? Uh, yeah. But I don't get to choose which one I'm giving up. Are we allowed to peek at the underside of the reliquary? I don't think so. I mean, that's no. Only only when he uh gives uh offers you citizenship, he can. Yeah. Look when at it's revealed, everyone. you can. But we can. 
Oh, I just meant the abilities. Like, the abilities on the Reliquary are known, right? I guess? Yeah, yeah, Those yeah are. sure. But then you just move over the Reliquary and... Uh... Yeah, I'll just look it up. Alright, I'm gonna go for the key. Alright, that man. gives... Gives you three red and any battle plan. Let's see, it doesn't look like there's any rules, so... Just let it happen. Alright, and blue, what do you want to do? And I'm going to add three dice over here. Okay, mercenaries. I, I have to include my warbands on my board, is that correct? Nope. Uh, yes. Because you're, um, because you're because getting attacked pawn. for a relic. It's attacking your pawn. Yeah. So basically, if you attack, um, if you attack the pawn, if you attack the relics, or if you attack the site the pawn is at, then the ones on the board come into play. Have to. Yeah. Uh, so we're at eight. Eight dice. Eight dice? No, no, no. You only get three dice plus right, the five. Plus five. Yeah. Plus five. You're right. And then uh, Mr. Steve can have up to five plus the three that he's using. Because he's using. Oh, you're using your uh, mercs. Yeah. So that's eight. All right. All right. Okay. There's no powers on my site, so that don't matter. Yep. Whenever you're ready. Ready? Ooh, rolled six. Six. That's eleven. Yeah. Plus and your 11. one, two, Ooh, three, four, it. five. You got five. He had eleven. Unfortunately, you oh, don't have enough. Three. One, two, three, four, five. Plus three is eight. What? No, it's Scott. three times two. Three times two. Yeah. yeah. Five, two, six. 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 And the five. So on you get uh, yeah. Four. Red four. has four. eleven. And unfortunately, yeah, you don't have enough. Uh, no. you only have enough to tie, which would mean you lose. Correct, and that was two. Yep. And you gotta lose two dudes. Yep, and you lose works. two dudes and the mercenaries. Which we can just drop that favor straight into the Discord. Bank. My butthole is clenched. <laughs> Yeah, you are you have been involved in every campaign so far this game. That's the first one that's really gone well for you. Well I can uh Oh what is what does y'all have? Right. I guess I could, uh, I got two left. Right. I don't think there's any way I could even, uh, get one. Get one what? One of his. Yeah, not really. Pretty, pretty long shot. Yeah, but he just doing the where, quick math. Where does the conspiracy go if it's played? It's, it's just done. Yeah, it's removed yeah, from the okay. game. It's a, it's a one shot. Uh, right, also, well, Red, yeah, it, it doesn't matter because you won anyways, but actually, since you were Oathkeeper, you should have had four dice there. Oh, nice. And in fact, how long have you been Oathkeeper? Just one? Yeah, this is the first one. Okay. This was the first one. I guess it won't matter because with your vision, you'll win. You don't need to worry about Usurper. Yeah, I'm gonna leave it up to uh, yellow now. All right. You mean like literally everybody else at the table coming at me right now? You did the vision. I'm gonna use my Fey merchant to draw one relic. That's the that's what you get for doing the vision. Yep. Yeah. All right. <laughs> Thank you. Jeez. Jeez, Louise. That's what I get. What is oh what boy. is Black's win condition though? Black's win condition is to get the Oath Keeper and uh keep it until he can't, keep it uh, for the usurper. They they can't because they they need this vision of faith which they don't have. 
I mean, they could get Oathkeeper. It'd be tricky, though. You have to get... It's called Kingmaking. Yes, it is. Well, <laughs> <laughs> next time, if next time we play together on the Chancellor, I will definitely yeah. bring you into. The I definitely like to go Chancellor, Exile, Chancellor, Exile. I've found. Well, the Chancellor still has a chance to win this. Absolutely. No, because yeah. he no longer has Oathkeeper. Not this turn, but if I can get it back yeah. this next round and nobody takes it away. Although, the likelihood of that. Yeah. So, cause we, yeah, now we don't roll the purple die. Yeah, and I see Citizen over there trying to get get some favor put to put back. Oh. Flip that. Hmm. What did you draw? Cracked horn. Cracked horn. Yeah, it's a cracked, cracked ah, relic. Ah, that's not very helpful. That's... No. <laughs> <laughs> Thought it would be better. Uh, yeah, this pity. isn't so much a card, card game as it is the uh, economy game. I mean, it's rude. That's a really rude card in the early game. Yeah. We're, we're well into the late game at this point. I'm gonna move to the Lush Coast. Alright. That's two. Then I'm gonna trade with Lush Coast. Sure. Yeah, and then that's my turn. Right, right. Look at all that. What is going on over there? What's going on with the Beast Bank? I, yeah, nobody's been taken from Beast. 11. 11 favor in the Beast Bank. <laughs> Dude, this is straight up like forest racket going on, man. White, your turn. Yeah. Well. I could always offer five relics to an exile, but... Only have the four here. I'm pretty sure I only have four. Let me check. Yeah. You have three. Three. Well, I'm, I think he's talking about the reliquary. Yeah. Four. One, two, three, four. Wow. Search the world deck. There's still one more vision in there somewhere. Mm -hmm. Oh, I apparently could do four relics and banners from my own stock and one from the reliquary. Well, I still only have four in that case. Wait, did you say you can give yourself relics from the reliquary? No, no, no. If I offer citizenship to someone, I could give them one Correct. from the rel reliquary. But... Yeah. So, here's a thought, Chancellor. So then you go to, uh... Oh, never mind. I'm not gonna... Yeah. So, Chancellor... Let me look yes. at this again. You could offer citizenship, right, and give a relic to somebody. I could. Can they trade that relic back to you? Uh, hmm. I think you'd have to be somewhere where you could do it. Right there? Tribunal or the trade area. I'm going to be right back. I don't think so. Not unless, yeah, unless you're at the tribunal or the, uh, the Tinker's Fair. You mean this Tinker's Fair over here? Yes. All right, and then I will spend one to recover the Darkest Secret. Oh, wait, can you? Oh, yeah, there's only six on yeah. there. 
and he doesn't. This guy, this guy makes Tinker's Fair makes it possible. Uh, does it? Huh. If there's a card at your site which soup does not match one of your advisors. Oh right, yeah. So. Yeah, but he's at the river. Wait, yeah, he's no, he's at, at the, the river. Valley. That's what he rules at Fertile Valley, but his pawn is at the river. Yeah, if it doesn't, if there's no oh, card there, down. it he matches. Moved down. Yep. Oh, he moved down there. Yep, yep. that got gotcha. you. Oh, 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 okay. Well, it... we can do this then. Yep, yep, Melvord came oh, in saying, good. can't do it. Oh, but okay. if you play a card ah. there, you can exactly. There yeah, you go. Nice one. Ooh, press gang. You get the... Uh... Oh, no, you don't. Okay. Here we go. Get... <laughs> he gets he gets five. Yeah, I gotta put all seven on there. Right. Big oof. It's a rope toe in conquest. <laughs> Tug of war? Rope Tug of war, yeah. Sorry. Oh no, that's Oh maybe it was regional. I mean the then... same thing. Then the secret that I just got from there, I will use my last supply to trade. Okay. And Are you sure get... you want to do that? There's nothing in the order deck. Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah. Or the order bank, nothing, I should say. Nothing in the order bank. Well, that doesn't help me then. Take your one back. Take your one supply back. All right. That's right. Yeah, you can just bank that. I should have done that differently then with what I was... That's right. Okay, so I'm at 11, and that tops me out then. And I don't have anything on the board to clean up. All right. Round seven. Oh, we're getting down Under to the chance. wire here. Oh, no, you're not the Oath Keeper, so no no yep, roll. Yep. No dice rolls. All right. So basically, the Chancellor has to... Stop me. Yeah, the Chancellor uh, has to stop you, otherwise it's done. That's exactly right. So let me see here. First off, I gotta deal with the, uh... I gotta deal with this, so I'm just gonna drop that into the... Let's say Order Bank. Uh... Let's say, actually, Hearth. And then I'm going to... Muster... On the Old Oak. Or, wait. Yes. Yes, I will do that. So that's... Two. And that that is one supply. And then I'm gonna do two to head on over here. I'm going to campaign. I am attacking the oracular pig. Okay. So that gets you three dice. Two for the pig and one for the oath keeper. Correct. Then I can do. Let's see. I can do seven. Um, plus. That just gains me one supply, so I'll just do that for the sake of it. You you can do uh you can do this as well, right? Which one? Yeah, yeah. I'm just kind of surveying what I can do first. Uh. Oh wait, and uh oh no, went target. No, no. Um And I'm also gonna do wolves because I rule that site, so that's gonna take one off your board. Leaving you with the four. So I have not doing the mountain giant? Uh I'm going to I'm three, deciding man. if I want to do the three or the I think, well, if I do the one, that still gives me eight, which I think should be fine against his three, so let's... Yeah, but if if it doesn't, it's it's over. Ah, that's true. <laughs> you know what? So yeah, what I'm gonna... What is to lose? I'm going the full full ten. This is yeah. this ain't time to pussyfoot around. Then I'll so discard it at the end of this. Oh, and I, yep, I gotta toss a favor on it. Or a secret. All right, let's roll. Oh, what Come do we on. got? You got four, four. 
plus your four on the board. That's eight. Oh, that's not a good one. And then, oh, God, yeah, that's a terrible roll for me. So I lose one immediately. And that's uh, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So I got to get rid of two. That's not too bad. So let's... Still got it, though. Yeah, still counts. So then I lose two warbands. Yep. Yep. And I become Oathkeeper. So that puts me just ahead there. And let's see, I got the two. It still uh, cost me four. You only add four. I don't think you become Oathkeeper. We're tied. What? That was four against three. Oh, right, you took it from me. Never yeah, mind. yeah, yeah, you lose it, so I'm, I'm ahead. I'm a loser. Oh, boy. All right. <laughs> then I still have two supply. How many do I have in the bag? Ten. So should I save that, or should I... Yeah, I'll save it. Which brings me back up to here. Um, I get to take one from... Let's take it from Arcane. Because of that guy, I get my two secrets back. Uh, this goes to the beast. So that's 12 in the beast now. Nobody wants to pull from that, I guess. Um, that is everything all right red what do you got what do i got campaign again oh maybe i should have campaigned again well no all of his have three though so that's that's pretty rough ah, yeah, maybe i should have you're, you're in a much better position than i am at the moment i think i'm okay this is the last turn also oh so yeah you Black, black got it. I forgot to discard the giants. You are on course to win? Yep, unless I become a massive... Well, actually, that's why I don't want to campaign again, because I'm probably going to be a big target, so I don't want somebody to try and rip, uh, try and rip anything away from me. Yeah, I think that's, that's my out, really, is to try to steal one back. Yep. Do you think you could? I I don't think it matters, but I think I can. I think I have to try. You have the full supply, so yeah. think careful. Oh no, my phone is getting low. It should be able to last the rest of this. Oh, I could look at the world deck with... Well, I'm not going to draw from the world deck, so I'm okay for right now. Thank you for the reminder, though. Yeah, I feel like I do I draw a card, hope for something. Info is key. Ah, uh, you're making me second guess. Must are you are you gonna draw from the world deck? I don't think I am. Okay, I'm gonna use a regular pig to just check that real quick. I'll put him right back. I think I need to muster. So to do that, I need to get one Whoa. from any. <clears throat> oh, okay. That's what's been in the world deck this whole time. Got it. Does anyone, <clears throat> anyone want to give me uh, money? You don't want to see the Chancellor win, do we? Yeah, but are you going to be the one to stop me? That's really their question. Well, then yeah, yeah, they can always, yeah, they can always attack you. Let me, let me soften you up. All right, let's see what you can do. Uh, Keep in mind. Yeah, so I, have um, I have Tinker's Fair. If anybody wants to throw a favor at me, I can muster an additional two units. <sighs> Come on. Does anyone want to give me a favor? Nah, sorry. Okay. Metal board says, hey, glory to the Empire. <laughs> I mean, everybody's got to pick a side, right? I didn't say yeah. you don't necessarily have to pick the right one. <laughs> we shall see. We shall see. All right. Um, so let's see. Mustard. And that's it so far. OK, 
can get another money, but it's not going to let me do anything. Moving's too expensive around here. You know, I just realized I've been wearing my headphones this whole time, but since it's on my phone in front of my face, I actually don't need to. Alright, yeah, let's just do this. Uh, you have Oath Keeper now, so this is going to be... Oh yes, yes I do. It's going to be a heck of a time. Sure is. Alright, we'll take the Oracular Pig again. Okay. Going after the Oracular Pig, so Ramparts doesn't trigger on that particular one. Let's see, I don't have any other defensive ones. Nope, so that's three dice I go with, and you can do up to four. Yeah, we're just going all in. All right. It's risky, but you might look out here. So whenever you're ready. Oh, so you got three, so I got three and I got, I got four. All right, so I'm going to uh, Wait, wait, more, wait, I got four plus the four on my board. So okay, that's so eight. No so you could only go up to seven. Yep. So that is a fail. Lose two. Yeah, unfortunately. Too bad. And let's see. I'm just gonna take a favor. I should honestly just run, run away to the cradle. That'd be a pretty good defensive move. And I think that's. Yeah, that was a that. <clears throat> uh, and then I will pay two to move to the mine. Okay. Let's see, I've got two, I've got 12, so we're going to go all the way back up. All right, uh, just, I'll clean up. All just right, there. Pale King, what do you got? You're going to get the Dark Seeker again, right? Otherwise, uh, white oh yeah, wins. that's a good point. White is still a threat right now. White is still winning now. All right. Yeah, I thought you would. Going back and forth and back and forth with it. Oh. Well, I appreciate that. If I should, uh, in fact, hmm, I almost want to make black. Would you want to be a citizen? Because you've been helping out a lot. On my turn, I could... Uh, well, if I have another turn, I could make you a citizen. I may end up just winning this round. What am I offering? Uh, let me let me look at the reliquary. I haven't looked at it recently. Hmm, that could be useful. No, that's not. Hmm. Uh, I'm offering either this one or this one. You can peek at those.
moving over. What's that? What are you? Oh, are you campaigning against blue is what you're saying? No. What are you doing? He's pointing to his board. Hold on. Something about your board. Three words. Starts with the... I think... Are you asking about citizenship? Oh, he's just thinking it over. Okay, okay. Wow, well, I thought he was pointing at the board and going, hey, I want to flip it. Right, yellow is the citizen, so that I get it, I get you now. All right, take your time, take your time. It's a, it's a hard decision, but the Empire will treat you quite well should you join our ranks. Relics from the board. No, they do. They definitely yeah. count. It is a relic. Yeah, and any relics will count towards the victory condition. Are you trying to see if you can get five <laughs> before I would win? Because I'll bring you up to a banner and a relic, so you'd need three more. If you think you have a plan to find three more, then I welcome you to try. Ooh! Hard bargain. A favor and a secret. Ah! Uh, no, no. It doesn't it doesn't even necessarily benefit me. I'm just thinking of how it's gonna affect the chronicle. A favor. A favor could be useful to me. That's good for mustering. But I am able to get one every turn. Hmm. Oh, nah, nah. I'm I'm saying relic or no deal. No no more than that cuz it doesn't it actually would hurt me quite a bit cuz I'd be losing 6 of my war bands and that would really wreck my supply. So it's, it's honestly a move of hubris more than anything. That's true. It also it won't happen until my uh, my next turn. So keep that in mind. It already won by then. Exactly. Okay, the offer is open, but unfortunately, because it's an action, I can't do it until my turn. Really? Yeah, on yeah. it's on the Grand Scepter. So if you're still interested, if I don't win at the end of this uh, round, then it is it is open to you. So, if people take his relics, he doesn't win. Because I, I become Oath Keeper again. <laughs> uh, you'd have to take... Let's see, how many do I have? Four? You would have to take yeah. at least two. Two of them. Because if there's a tie, it, it stays with whoever has it. Correct. But there's three people who could potentially steal one from you. That's true. That is very true. I will also take a Tinker Tinker Fair Trades. You could. Ah, that's true. Like, like white, I would. Oh, you don't have any relics, but I could give you secrets. Oh, you can do it for me. Oh no, you can't, cause I'm not there. Nope. I mean, I'm not there either. But. All right. That looks like Black is checking to make sure there's no actions to miss out on. With any player, you can do you can do the Tinker Ooh. Fair with me as well. Yeah. Uh, if, oh yeah, you can have my relic if I can get two favor. 
two favor. I only have one favor. Well, yeah, keep in mind, you only become the successor if I win as Oath Keeper. So if he takes Oath Keeper away, then you still lose. Yes, that's true. Mm. So two favor for a relic. That's well, less how, how, how can we get the two from you, Dan? I'll a secret for I mean, favor blue. campaigning would be an option, and yeah, you can take the people's favor if you can figure out how to trade for it. No. Okay, no deal. Alright, so I traded, I mustered, I mustered. Okay. I'm gonna spend two and depart the Fertile Valley. Okay. I'm gonna join Red over here. Oh boy. Sure. Oh. Yellow doesn't seem very loyal, Metal Board. I agree. <laughs> Something tells uh, me it was a mistake to allow you into the Empire. Yeah, it was. <laughs> if I have another turn, perhaps oh. I will exile you. We shall see. Maybe you, maybe you will. Maybe I will. Are you attacking me? Yes, I am. Four I arms never to be trusted. You can never <laughs> trust four arms. We're gonna go for that key. Okay. Going for the key. All right. I get three dice. Yep. And I'm gonna rock all seven. All right. <clears throat> Six, seven. All right. Three. Let's see how it goes. <laughs> what did you say, Black? Only people with shady black cloaks and hoots of turns were already. Okay. All right. So, uh, Blue, did you roll? Four. Yes. Uh, oh, no, those are both times two, so I got two. Zero, yeah. Well, you Seems get zero because it's two, it's two times zero, then two times zero again. Yeah, but I saw my two dudes. So, so yeah, you get two, two, and so that means that uh the one, four, two. the four that yeah. blue has wins. So you lose a guy, and you lose that key. Well, just really didn't want me to win, huh? That's what happens when you do the visions. Puts a target right on your back. I'm already, no, I'm already losing. I, I'm already. You're just stopping any potential. Just sealing your, your chancellorness. Alright, and now Blue, are you going to use that key? Uh, you don't roll this. Oh, that's true. You way. can't unless you move. Correct. He's out of... Out of yeah, supply, so maybe next, maybe oh, next wait, round. Oh, wait, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on, I'm not out. Oh. Oh, yep, he could use right, that yeah, to get the two supply. I'm going to spend that right there. And all you gotta do is move up or down. Back. And yeah, you can move back to King now if you wanted to. Huh? Move up, right? I can't move down. I have yeah, to either move good. up or across. True. Is it? Yeah, you could go to, go to salt flats. Salt flats is you nice. Could to, you could go to plains also. Yeah, I can go anywhere but. Uh, the hidden place. Sure. Or or the river. Or the Fertile Valley. Because it's two everywhere. So yeah. I guess it doesn't matter where I go at this point, does it? Well, if you want Not to really. Oh, no, uh, Lush Coast would be the place to go because there's still space for two. Do what now? Right. Or what What do you mean by two? It's It's... It's too supply to move. Yeah, it's yes. too supply to move from there. Yeah, to move to any place from there. From yeah. the provinces. It doesn't matter which one I go to. No, as long as I rule it, you can use the key. Yeah, we'll go up here to the tribunal. Okay. <clears throat> and that's two. Uh, actually, Metal Board, I got you there. Um, He doesn't need to kill a warband to move to my site. He needs to do it to move from my site. So he's Correct. safe. And then the key, I can put one on there, and I can burn one. Yep. 
Aha, metal board. We were on top of it this time. All right, so yep. And do that action. You can only peek at any one, huh? There's only one. Peek it, yeah, you can peek at one, and then you may choose to take it. No hints. Choose wisely. What do you, what do you think, Pell King? Which one should I take? No hints? You, ch you choose. <laughs> Oh, I thought table talk was allowed. He just can't reveal. Uh, no. Well, it, yeah. I could, I yeah. could, but I'm choosing not to. No, I'm talking about Pale King. He's he's looked at two of them. Oh, that's right. Yeah, yeah. If Pale King wants to tell you which ones, which ones there were. I suppose he's allowed. He looked at this one. He looked. He looked at the end ones. So this one and that oh, one. What do you think I should take, Pale King? Take either of those. Think that one? That one. Okay. Peek at it. Alright, well, I'm just gonna take it, because if I peek at it, I gotta take it, so... Yep. Yep. Greedy. Oh. That's all right. Really nice. That's interesting. Yep, so now that means I cannot draw from the world deck. Not that I was going to. I know what's in there. And there's some interesting things, but... Not an option okay. anymore. Oh, well. King. King. Unless I had the darkest secret, but I'm not going after that. I'd need ten secrets to do that right now. This book. This book and... Alright, yellow. Alright. Okay. Got going on. We're going to do some fun stuff. I'm gonna trade at the... Okay. Crossing finds. Finally someone's taken from Beast. And then I'm gonna move to there. So that's three. And I'm gonna trade at the wolves. Ah. Ah. I see your <laughs> you game. You see what I'm doing. <laughs> um. One, one, two, one. So I can actually move to. Uh, where do I want to move to do this? I'm gonna move to here. That's gonna give me two. Gonna trade with this one. Gonna get one more. And then I'm gonna get the people's favor. All right. You get it. <laughs> I don't lose Oathkeeper, though, because three is still more. Yeah, yeah, but that was the point. <laughs> you right. need to be Oathkeeper. <laughs> That's fine. If you win with that, I'll, I'll be fine. If the Empire wins, then it's enough for me. Uh, I'm gonna put all where's sticks. Where's my last one going? Back to the animal. Animals? Back to the beast. Animals, yeah. There we go. There is no. And then I'm gonna to refresh to the almost left more space. Yep. I'm gonna get my secrets back. And ending my turn. All right, Captain Badger. <gasps> What's the plan? I wish I knew. <laughs> <laughs> you got a lot of secrets yeah, you. that you could be trading for favors. Hard to get all the... It's hard to compete with Magician's Code. Yeah. How about leave me alone? <laughs> the problem is the people I need to trade with are nowhere close. Mm, yeah. And nobody... <sighs> To go to the Tribunal or Fertile Valley and use the Tinker's Fair, nobody has favor to just swap with me anyway. I have a I mean, single favor. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, boy. So, if... Our Chancellor's just down to three relics. Right. I, That's right. I, if you can take out one out more... I take one. Then, uh, no, actually, if you take out one more, then I still am tied for most, so I don't lose Oathkeeper. So you'd have to take out two. Two, yeah. 
Yes. Or you could give one oh. to me. <laughs> that would do it also. Oh, yeah. I, I'll give you both of my uh, secrets if you can get the... That's probably not enough supply. I'll do this. Hmm. I mean, I could play, play, and hope that it doesn't end. Yeah, yeah. I mean, it's it's a one in five. It's a coin flip, or a what? A one in two slash fifty percent. It is a coin flip. And honestly, trying to take one from you, I probably don't have the strength to do it anyway. So yeah. maybe. Maybe the long. You do have your full supply. Yeah. You could be trading for favors to get to muster. A muster, but it's gonna take three just to get to you. You gotta use that yeah. mine trick. You go to the mine, yeah. drop the mine, get two more. But even then, I'm not. I'm doing all that to to muster and get. Yep. Actually, to lose the Oath Keeper, yeah. you need to lose two, two. Yeah. relics, right? Yep. Yeah. It's. I would spend two just going to the mine, then I'd have to trade with Hearth to get one. So you'd need a favor. So, well, I could, I could trade there to get one favor, oh. and then I'd have to move again to muster and okay. fight. I don't, I don't think I, I just don't have the supply to pull it all off. Yeah, that's tricky. It's it's two, two to move, two to fight is four, five to trade, six to muster. I mean, I could do it, but you're talking about four against your four, plus the oath keeper. Alright, I'm just gonna... We'll leave it up to the dice. Alright. I'm gonna do two to travel. Okay. And I will go... Here. Okay. Then I'm going to trade with that guy, which gets me two favor because... Oh, yeah, I yep. Troop. And the beasts are the place to get it. Yeah, the place to... I mean, you're a nomad. Eight. Damn. So chat seems and to then... think... Chat seems to think my interpretation of phase, right? Another two hmm. down there. Travel. And that requires flipping a secret. Then... And I will spend one to trade with the old oak. Secrets. Yeah, honestly, I I agree with the chat on that, thinking about it, since it's the Fey merchant and they're, they're a, a tricksy people. It would make more sense for them to and just steal a relic away if you don't have one. one. One last trade gets me one from Discord. All right. And now we have to clean up. Go all the way back up here. Go there. This comes back here, and that goes back there. And I guess it's time to roll. All right, let's find out. One, two, three, four. We're going to round eight. Oh, boy. Or wait, no. It's higher, so four actually does end it. Yes. Yep. Yes, which means... Yeah, I was just yep. looking at it. So the successor <laughs> is yellow. Yellow wins. Yes! Second game, second win. <laughs> just, just over three hours, so actually that was not, that was not too long. For six players. 
And we almost went the full thing. Probably would have only gone to about three and a half. Wow. Yeah. That, that moved that moved pretty well. Yeah. Yeah. Definitely. We we didn't have a lot of we didn't have a lot of dice rolling, which sometimes slows things down a little That's bit. That's true, yeah. There was very little campaigning compared to most of the games I've played. Alright, let me make a save wait, state. Wait, 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 wait. What? first one to take a picture of this. Okay, okay. Go for it. For T T uh, for uh BG stats. Oh yeah, definitely. All right, Thanks. let me. All right, so now I'll save it in case it crashes during the chronicle, which is something that could happen according to the uh, the page for this on the Steam Workshop. Save that. All right, and now declare that winner. Could have ended a long time ago if that stupid conspiracy wasn't on top of the deck. Exactly. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Right. yeah, sorry, but I had to do Wait, that. To win. No, you, no, you had to do it. No, All right, the winner it. has no. one relic, so that goes right to on top him. of the reliquary. Uh, do you want to know if if you actually exiled me? That would be nice, cause ah, oh. <laughs> oh. that was my that, that that was the the thing. Okay, okay. <laughs> that was going to secure the win for me. Yeah, that was the big thing. That. The people's favor and darkest secret switched hands a lot. I feel like the people will suffer from the rule of yellow. All right, you did win by succession. All right, what do you want for the new oath? Renny? Are you there? Sorry, 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 okay. sorry, sorry. Okay, sorry. I was just talking with my girlfriend. I was just laughing. No. We didn't no, We didn't thought I, I would win uh, half, well, halfway through the game. When yeah, you no, it, it was... Favor. I shouldn't have I taken... Didn't, I didn't see an option. Okay, okay. Uh, what did you ask me? Sorry. Uh, which oath do you want for the next game in the Chronicle? Supremacy is Sights, oh. People's Favor, or Darkest Secret? Um, I think Darkest Secret is fun. All I right. didn't play that one yet. This is nice. That's Devotion. Confirmed. And now, uh, you may replace a Denison card with an Edifice or repair a Ruin. So would you want an Edifice on any of the sites that are still visible? Yeah, I would like an Edifice. All right, which site do you want it at? Uh... Um, what what does it do? Does it? Um, it's basically like rampart. Rampart is one. So yeah, it's basically yeah. each suit has a specific edifice, and it will replace. Um, it will replace, replace that one. And you can see, like, there's a a reverse side. That's gonna get, I believe, destroyed after this game. Yeah, yeah. Um, then maybe at the uh, lush coast. Lush coast. Best coast? Be suit. Yeah, well, it'll do it automatically in this, so cool. it'll just pick the the beast one, Lush Coast, Grasping I think it's Vines. The beast, yeah, the Beast Temple or whatever. I think Confirmed. It is. Yes, the Forest Temple. Ooh, so okay, that one only affects the Chronicle. That's interesting. Are you good with that? Uh, I, I, we can't see it, but. Uh, oh, can you not? Uh, I can't. No. Oh, okay. Well. I'll confirm. They can all be seen at the the card database at the yeah I right. Know. Uh, okay, and do you yeah. want to add beast or order to the deck? Uh, yeah, maybe beast, huh? Beast, yeah, that was the one that was packed in the economy. All right, there we go, and now we can export it, drop it into the legacy, which I will. I'll copy it for now. So yeah, good game. That yeah, was, that was so fun. That was six very people, different. It's way more fun. Uh, it, it's it's a whole different game. The the rampage of all the different conditions at the end. That was that was that was weird. It was so nice. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, be sure to. I can see how you might not want to do it with five new players if only one person. Oh yeah. Oh, but, no, 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 with new players. Once you have people that know know the game. Yeah. Yeah, thanks for watching, Metal Board. Um, I hope to do this again sometime. Probably not as many. I think I'll probably keep the six player to once a month at most. Because it's, it's fun, but it's, it's definitely yeah, like a pretty big event.
All right. Well, good game, everybody. I'm going to drop and finish off my stream. Hope to play with you all again sometime soon. Yep. Yep. Thank uh -huh. you, guys. Thank you. GG. Yeah, GG. All right. Let me end this call. Ah, take me to the call. It was a good game, guys. Yeah, very good game. There we go. All right. Goodbye. Good game. All right. Thank you so much for watching, everybody. This was a ton of fun. Much longer than the streams I tend to do. Uh, well, maybe not much. It's only a little under four hours. But yeah, that was that was a ton of fun. I hope you all enjoyed it. It's a little different from stuff I generally do. And yeah, I hope to do more again. So in the meantime, thank you very much for watching, whether it's in the past, the present, or the future. If you want to catch the beginning of the stream because you missed it, or any of my other streams, you can check the past broadcast tab where you'll see the last 60 days worth of streams I did. You can also check down below to get a link to Iggy Kid Twitch Archive. It's a YouTube channel where I have all of my streams. They all go up uh, noon the day after I do them, if if I remember to. Sometimes I've forgotten. Apologies. Um, you can also, if you want to make sure that you get to see future streams, you can check um, you can check the schedule down below, which says what game on what day I'm going to be doing Pokemon I'm going to be finishing off the story of Pokemon Shield tomorrow, so that should be fun. Uh, you want more specific times, you can click the lion icon right over there and go to the schedule tab. It'll say what hour and what game on what day, but that's all subject to change. So if you want to make sure you don't miss anything, follow me on Twitter, at IggyDKid. I tweet out about 30 minutes before every stream, so turn on notifications and everything. That didn't work one time, though, so if you want to be absolutely sure you never miss anything, follow me, click the heart. It's free for you if you have a free Twitch account. And it helps out the channel a great deal. I got two more on this last stream. So that brings me up to 47. That means I'm three away from affiliate, which would help out a great deal. So please consider following. I'd really appreciate it. Also consider uh, checking out Iggy and the Ape. That's my personal YouTube. I've been posting stuff weekly on Fridays recently. I do board game unboxings. I do, I've done a board game review. I plan to do more of those uh, movie reviews, book reviews, different silly stuff. I did like a couple of silly things. Like, I did, like, a, a Sonic PowerPoint presentation that was really funny. I think so, anyways. Yeah, that You you be the judge. Go, go watch it and all that. I'd really appreciate it. So, once again, I'd like to thank you for inviting me into your home, your computer, your phone, your tablet, your game console, Roku, Apple TV, however it is you watch today. I really appreciate you tuning in. I hope I brought some entertainment and levity to your day. I hope you'll join me tomorrow for some Pokemon Shield at about 8 p.m. Eastern. And if no one else has said this to you, I'll say this to you now. You're a good kid. Thanks for watching, everybody. Goodbye. Goodbye. Join me tomorrow. Pokemon, go check out my YouTube and everything. Thank you for joining. Uh, actually, I'm going to probably see if there's anybody streaming right now to see if I can raid you guys over. Let me check that. Um, let me just, yeah, see. I like to be able to raid over to someone else who's streaming. Uh... Oh, these are bigger Twitch. I don't think they're going to... Eh, whatever. It's not going to hurt anything to try. So they might reject this, but um, I'm going to send you over to Sideways. He does some fun stuff. So just a moment. Sideways 440. Let's see if that will work. All right. So go enjoy that. Tell them I sent you. I hope you have a great day. Thanks for joining in. Goodbye, everybody. Good night. Goodbye.